not. Um, um, hello. Hello, hello. I'll turn this down a little bit more. Look at that. How are we doing today? <laughs> How are y'all doing? Two deaths, one nut is wild. <laughs> Two deaths, one nut is very ominous. That's an ominous fortune to get. <laughs> also, yeah, but spot your psychic advisor nuttled. They said, nut den, my nut encountered the nut. <laughs> Butt spot, please. <laughs> Butt spot, please. <laughs> hello, hello. How are we doing today? I'm very tired and like just kind of blah today. How are y'all doing? We had we had freezing rain, but thankfully it didn't like melt all the snow. So like, but it also just means that all the snow now has a crust of ice on top of it. It was a little weird, but I'm glad that the snow didn't go away. <laughs> Because we have so much snow anyway, so I guess it just only melted a little bit, probably. But yeah. <laughs> I'm excited. I decided I do want to play more Strange View today, like I said in the Discord. Um, I'm just in the mood. I'm in the mood to, to focus on a little early Strange View moment. Um, I'm intrigued by the Burb storyline. I didn't really know what to expect with the Burbs. But um, the whole, like overbearing mother-in-law thing is very interesting for them and i i don't know i i, I don't know where it's gonna go <laughs> uh it was a good mood earlier but let me tell her mom she that she woke me up this morning it made her get in a mood with me i don't even know oof oof hi gabby hello, hello. yeah so i think we'll we'll do that um i was i took a moment to dig through the 
machinima suggestions to just try to get a sense of any machinimas that we haven't watched yet and stuff like that. We'll, we'll probably try and do like a halftime machinima as well as an end machinima to try to knock some of those out. Um, trying to dig up because there's also some recent ones that are shared that kind of look cool. So I don't know, we might jump around and do like an older one and a recent one or something. Yeah, a little halftime game. <laughs> a little halftime football. Yep. I've never seen that emote before. Oh, it's a Twitch global emote. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. Hi, Comey. How are you doing? But yeah, I feel like it's a drowsy day for everyone. <laughs> it feels like a chill day. <laughs> Yeah, my day was okay. It was pretty uneventful. Like I said, just kind of, just kind of blah today. <laughs> I um went on an adventure yesterday that like kind of messed me up as far as like I got wicked car sick, so it like made me feel like crap the rest of the day. But because I have this weird thing where like if I'm driving for a long distance, I'm fine. But if I'm riding in the car for a long distance, I get wicked car sick. I guess it probably has to do with me being like in control of the movements of the vehicle versus having to be along for the ride, I think. Um, but yeah, <laughs> but yeah, we got um, the news back that Echo, the pony who's been having issues and stuff, she tested positive for something called something's. It's called Cushing's disease, which um, it sounds like a bad thing to be diagnosed with a disease, but it's actually helpful <laughs> because it, it gives us a reason that she might be doing having the issue she's having and there's special medicine she can be on for it. Um, so it was it sounds like a bad thing, but it's actually a good thing that she got diagnosed with it. <laughs> it's because we have an answer for something. Um, oh, okay. The dog had Cushing's disease. I think from the vet tried to kind of explain it to me, and I tried to pick up as much of what she was trying to explain as I could, but it was pretty much, um, like it's like something to do with the brain, like a gland in the brain or something. I don't know, but then in horses it can affect the feet and everything, and so she's on a new medicine. Thankfully, the, see the one positive with having minis is that when they're on medicine, they take such a low dosage that the expense of the medicine isn't as bad because it lasts so much longer, but it still is a little, like, we got a box of it yesterday, and we had to, we had to, to drive quite a ways, um, to the, to the vet's house to pick it up from there. It's like, which, I don't know, for those that are not maybe as familiar with, like, big animal vets, um, I agree. Um, um, the, the way that it kind of works is big animal vets don't really have like a vet office very much. Um, they usually work out of like, they just like, cause they're visiting vets. You don't usually take your animals to them. They come to you. So like she had medicine for us and it was easier for us to just go pick it up. So we just like drove to her house to pick it up, but she lives like out in the boonies, which it was a very pretty drive, but it was very, a long and winding and bumpy drive out into the middle of nowhere up in the mountains <laughs> it one one thing that was really pretty is like from her house you can see like a, there's like a big um ski resort thing which like you can see from the house and just like it's cool it looks cool and stuff but so yeah it was a long bumpy ride i ended up very car sick <laughs> but other than that it was good um but yeah, sorry, I missed some messages. So behind and lost on strange, early Strange Town, but I'm happy to catch a stream. And so yeah, it's it's hard with with the long form streams to to catch up. But yeah, there's just been so much so much chaos. <laughs> I really like early Pleasant View so far. It's been really cool. Uh, I realized later that the only reason why Tiffany supposedly make, makes Jennifer and John sleep in separate beds is probably because the creator couldn't fit one double bed in both bedrooms. Yeah. It's kind of fun though. I like that the making sort of the creative choices around that is pretty neat. Um, and thank you for the good vibes for a little echo. She's been moving a lot better. I don't know if I guess it must be a hormonal imbalance or something. It just affects all kinds of stuff. Hi, Allie. Uh 
Last time you played Kalente, I saw your early stranger template that Don was alien hybrid. Oh, did I have him selected as alien hybrid? That might have been a mistake. Oh, whoops, I have it down in... Oh, yes, I accidentally put him on... You're right. I did put him on alien hybrid by accident. He's just a human. I think all the other Calientes are, so I just went down the list. <laughs> Thank you. Good good catch. Jenny Marable's dog had cushion disease by making um feel stressed or anxious easily and makes them hungry or thirsty when they're not. Oof, yeah. With Echo, I think it's with horses especially. Also, thank you for the follows. Um, with with Echo, she's always we've always struggled with her weight, which affects her hooves, obviously. And she already has some issues. Um so yeah, so it's she's on like I said, she, she, the poor she's on two pain meds, she's on a thyroid medicine, and now her Cushing's medicine. Um, also, weird day that the professor didn't show up. It was weird. Out in the boonies, yeah. I don't really know where it comes from. <laughs> yeah, it's it's just a a saying of living out in the middle of nowhere, <laughs> out in the sticks. Did you see my early PV screenies? Also, you have a sick animal. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> I like the the blurt of information. Uh, I think I did. I think I did see your screens screened shots. Um, the the idea of getting carsick is like my brain gets sicky when I get into a big mental a mental metal transport device if I'm not driving. Like what? Yeah, I know. I think it has to do with the movement and not being like the one ch technically choosing the movement. I don't know. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. Why did I say hello, everyone? Hello, pair. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> um, yeah, she, I think she'll start doing... This is Indigo Candies here. Okay. Reincarnated this account. Okay, I was just about to say, I'm like, I, I assumed maybe the follow... I didn't know if it was a mistake, but I'm like, I've not seen the name before, but it doesn't tell me that you, it's your first time chat. So I was like, okay, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, also, hi, Toby. I missed, I missed Toby talking. What did I miss? Bum, bum, bum. I can see a reply to Toby, but I can't see Toby. <laughs> I don't know. My brain's mush right now. But I was early, not late. <laughs> uh... Yeah, you're very early. Sorry, my brain goes 90 places at once. No, it's okay. That's that's my brain also. You don't have to deal with me soon. I have work today. <laughs> no, we wanted to deal with you. We we want to deal with you. <laughs> I only get car sick if I get you in a car hungry. That's interesting. I feel like I'd get more sick if I got into the car like really full. Motion sickness is based on a person's balance. Yeah, I think so. And I think it's like my way of yeah some something with with that and you're just like your sense of of like where you are in space <laughs> and it's like i'm not in control of it rubbing pressure point on your wrist can help car stick some oh okay that's an i'll try to have to try to remember that double d that makes me think of ed ed and eddie double d uh, I used to have bands that did that when I was younger. Oh, that's kind of cool. I don't do it too often. Usually I'm the one always driving, but it was a it was a rare occasion that I wasn't the one driving, so. Blue liquid glasses help with ca car sickness. That's weird. Uh-oh, I hope the asshole customer doesn't come in tonight. Oof. Oof. I know that feeling. <laughs> I know that feeling. I'm going to swap over to the video game. Let's play the video game. How about that? Let me go. Hopefully everything's working. Yeah, it looks like it's it's alive and well. Alive and well. Hi, DJ. Um, There we go. I sleep in the, a lot in the car if I'm not driving. I don't know if I... I think I probably slept in the car as a kid, but I don't know if I could do it now. I don't know if I could do it now. Uh okay. So here's Mr. uh Mr. John Burb being an Animal Crossing villager. Meanwhile, his wifey is taking care of the baby. 
Um, for those that might have missed kind of the setup of this household before, um, this is Jennifer Pleasant and John Burb, who they're not married yet, but they already had a baby. When we very first started the household, Jennifer was pregnant and then like immediately gave birth. Um, and then they're living with Tiffany Burb, who currently is off the lot right now. Tiffany is John's mom. And she's kind of just like a, a nightmare mother-in-law that wants to be in control of everything. And I think Jennifer uh, is trying to get rid of her one way or another. I'm not sure. <laughs> Which I could join with Jeb at the lurk and said, okay, have a good lurk. Thank you for lurking. Playing house flipper. I have three dogs in a studio apartment. This is too much. Oh, I've never played that. I've seen people who, I, like, I've seen people play it. I've never played it. Yeah, one way or another, murder. That's what we were kind of like. I don't know how. I don't know how she do it. <laughs> like, how do you murder your mother-in-law? How to Google, Google how to murder mom? How to murder mother-in-law? <laughs> yep, yeah, she's gonna be a girl, girl boss who's gonna slay literally. Look at these goofy glasses. Apparently, they work. Uh. Oh my god. Motion sickness. Oh, the baby just grew up in front of us. Okay. <laughs> As I'm clicked off. Yeah, I would like it very much to decorate. I, f I think I think I probably I could I would probably. Okay, the baby grew up. Wow, we're lagging too. I don't know why it's kind of like Death by flies or bees. Interesting. Okay, this is baby. Is it mirror? Does baby have wide eye? Like the eyes are pretty far apart. I get really lucky with my mother in law, but I, I could murder my father in law, not this. Oh no. Who, who does he get that from? Also, the baby's name is Bradley. We chose Bradley because of John's dad, who's passed away, is Brad. <laughs> But he's named after Brad. Thank you very much for the sub. Uh, Sydney Mode. <laughs> Let the song play. <laughs> Thank you very much for the prime. I really appreciate it. So yeah, that's the baby. Is this like his little outfit? Should I like... Maybe I'll change... I kind of don't love this little outfit. I don't love this little outfit. She's taking a minute. Hi, hello, mostly lurker, but I'm so happy to be able to catch a stream. I'm glad you were able to catch a stream. Welcome, welcome. Lurking is just fine. Lurking is just fine. I don't know. I feel like he should wear like little green overalls. Like that feels like John Burb child core. John Burb son core. So I guess I gotta get some actual baby toys. Um. Also, the other thing I did to tr to try and maybe help the pink flashing situation was uh, I did turn down the the hood. I don't know if I should maybe I turned off like I turned down the distance. I did. I maybe I shouldn't turn off fade distance because then I can't. See, it doesn't show me the hood, like the, the skirt, whatever it's called. I don't know if I have to reload. Maybe I should have turned fade distance off. Yeah, I don't know. Or decoration. Oops, I turned decorations off. That's what it was. There we go. See, there. so it's technically got something. At least there's something. At least there's something. Um, but yeah, I just tried to turn it down just to see <laughs> GTA San Andreas Fog. Yeah, I just thought maybe it would help with the pink flashing, especially with, um, downtown. What is that sound I'm hearing? Is it you? Hunting bugs? But yeah, so we're gonna have a, a wedding. We gotta have a wedding. It's only Sunday. We're gonna play these guys through through Wednesday. Um... So we'll have to see how that kind of works. I might have to put a baby gate door 
because of how tight this area is. It's kind of miserably tight. I'm going to put a different door here just to limit the little gremlin from getting in everybody's way because he's going to just end up bumping everybody all over the place. You know, we'll just have that. Just play with this. Oh, oh, we got teleported. Oops, wait. Can he go in? No, he can't. I'm gonna have her... Hold. Hold. Yeah, that would be... I was thinking about downloading the Poison mod. I almost thought I did. But I don't know. Hi, Luralu. Maybe, maybe I should at some point today like I could take a, we could take a BRB and I could or we could take our machinima break or, or something and install the poison mod I don't know how it works what is she she wants to play soccer you know what it's it's Sunday at 7 p.m play some soccer I guess what are you doing John you're just catching bugs jelly butterfly John is John is living his animal crossing fantasies out here Jennifer was a career cr criminal. She got a taste of blood and got addicted. What if that's the what if that's the kicker? Is that Jennifer is actually like a scam artist or something that like makes up like all these different identities and like takes people's money or something. And it's actually that Tiffany can sense that she's right <laughs> about Jennifer, but Jennifer is <laughs> that'd be funny. I don't think that's where we're going, but that would be a funny twist. Um, hello, Jenna. I certainly wish someone would create an extreme vi Yeah, I wish there was a better... We, we were talking about that a few times. I wish there were some better options. Uh-oh, somebody knocked over the trash can. John, why don't you take a break? What is Mommy in here doing? I'm gonna have them argue. You go here. <laughs> we need drama. Soccer mom scammer? That's how they'll explain her on the... Uh-oh. I think he's getting chased by bees. Okay. Uh, John is gonna die by bees? He also wants another goddamn baby. You can't even fit yourself in this house. Oh boy. Johnny. John. <laughs> Sir. Okay, well. Oh, she's going to sleep. You know what? That's fine. Yeah, I guess I should also put a, a baby, like a toddler bed in here. Oops. We're out of the category. I'll just do like a what is like the cheapest one? Or do I have one that matches their beds? <laughs> okay, Doby. When she finally snaps and kills Tiffany over her <laughs> body, she thinks maybe she was right. Maybe that is all I am, and runs away knowing she'll never be able to look John in the eyes again and becomes a con artist. <laughs> That'd be wild. A, a reality where John and Jennifer don't happen. That's kind of wild to think about. I don't know what kind of little bedding I'm going to give him. Just, I'll just do that. It's simple. Meanwhile, John's casually having a, a moment here. Oh god, they stopped finally. <laughs> god damn it. John knows about the birds and the bees. He's really passionate about them bees. Clean that up. I'm gonna take a shower. Ready, what is... What, she's drink thinking about, like, punching. How about you go up here? Because John's about to go in that ba bathroom, so... Why don't you go up here and go to sleep? It's kind of a boring little evening for these guys. Oh, you know what I was thinking about? I was trying to remember something. Hi, Vicky Bunny. I'm sorry you've been sick. Whole family got fever, so I've been MIA. I'm sorry. That sucks. Um, I hope you feel better soon. Um, oh, my coffee's hot. One thing I was, I remembered was, I, what if there is something where, so I feel like because of the way Jennifer is like, feels like she of john and jennifer i feel like jennifer is the one that's like dominant like she's in charge a little bit and john's just like whatever whatever she says goes and that's why he's also so much like like he's also like a mama's boy because like 
he's following what his mom says. And then once his mom's out of the picture, he follows whatever Jenny says, you know? And like... <laughs> not get well, like suck it up. <laughs> Get well. <laughs> Sick and bottom. Thank you very much for the prime. I appreciate it. Basils. Sick and bottom. Get nutter soon. <laughs> Butt spot saw the bottom part. <laughs> Said get nutter soon. <laughs> Thank you, Thicky Bunny. Um, but anyway, what if it was a situation where. Tiffany doesn't realize that John and Jennifer agreed to take Jennifer's last name. What if Jennifer's like, no, I'm not taking the burb name. You're taking the pleasant name. And John is just like a himbo that doesn't care. He's like, okay, yes, wifey. And then J Tiffany finds out and has like a heart attack and dies. <laughs> oh, <sorry. laughs> There's also that option. <laughs> We're having a lot of heart attacks in Pleasant View. Oops, I accidentally hit the pause. Ooh. Get better. Yeah, I'm sick. Skill issue. <laughs> Skill issue. <laughs> yes, Tiffany despises Jennifer. That's like the whole setup. She won't even let them like sleep in the same bed and stuff. It's like a whole thing. Aneurysm. Why did you get up? Was it him? What if I do the little cheating thing? I'm going to be a cheater and do this. I don't know what color I should use. Ugh, I gotta wait for her to get in the bed. What about this one? Ugh, come on. Okay. Uh, everything's too close to Sim. Oh my god, I just gotta use move objects and move her. Okay, wait, or do I, should I? Oh, 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 I messed it up. <laughs> I messed it up. I'm messing everything up. I have to wait for her to, like, finish settling into the bed. I don't know. I'm not awake today. There we go. There we go. Can I die from bees? Maybe. Can I die from bees? <laughs> Can I die from bees? Maybe. <laughs> Why does she keep getting up? I didn't see. Was it just a delayed reaction to the sound? <laughs> Maybe death by flies and we say they were bees. She's allergic and Jenny made John send the swarm after her. Maybe Jenny orchestrates. Maybe it'd be, it'd be cool if the they could. I'm sure there's custom uh, like bee houses. <laughs> yeah, you can die for bees. I, I bet there's like customs. Cust oh, my God. I'm like so out of it today. Uh, custom beekeeper houses. That'd be cool. If the, it'd be cool if there was some in the game just regularly. And then, like, Jen Jennifer encourages John to, like, get a bunch of bees, and then they, they attack his mother at the wedding. <laughs> yeah, kids playing music, she can't sleep. Yeah, I just thought that because I had... It, it was just a delayed reaction for me blocking it. Because I use... these. This blocks the sound, so she's not getting bothered anymore. She got up after I already put it down, so she just must have already had it queued up that she was going to wake up. Hi, dog. John John's just chilling. Wanna like, I don't know, go to sleep, John? John's just sitting on the bed with his sh pulled little cowboy boots on. Yeah, you got your pink UFO. I think that must be, it's the three month. The little pink one. I don't know what the next color. I think, is it after three months? It's the, like the gradient purple and pink. I forget, or is it a blue one? I don't remember. <laughs> Uh oh, you're being unsafe and driving and watching the stream? Terrible. Shame. <laughs> Don't drive and stream. <laughs> Be safe. Horrible. Jennifer wiping the blood off her face and, and weeding dress. <laughs> Wedding dress. <laughs> the job is done finally. Yeah, we've just got I just can't decide exactly how I want it done. I feel like I want it to be a Jennifer choice. Like Jennifer's like that's what I was like. If they if they take if Jennifer take has him take her name, she knows it's gonna get to to Tiffany. But maybe she doesn't realize it's gonna give Tiffany like a full on meltdown that she actually like dies. 
I think that that that'd be an interesting way to do it. Um, and then you know what would be funny is if we have John, of course, being a mama's boy, he panics and tries to save her. So that, and then it's kind of the 50-50 if he saves her or not. And if he does save her, we'll have to figure out another way to kill her down the line. <laughs> like, Jenny's going to keep trying to kill her, and John's going to keep saving her. <laughs> Hi, Casey. <laughs> yeah, heart attack using the fright one, I think. I drive and stream all the time. It's okay to listen to, yeah, listening is fine. Typing and typing while driving, maybe not the best. It's like Tom and Jerry scenario. <laughs> They just, they keep waking back up. Also, everybody's just sleeping. Why am I... Oh, of course you're not sleeping. Where are you... What are you doing? Why... She's out here in her bare feet. Grandma's having a meltdown. She's gonna get sick. You gotta... Oh, somebody knocked over our trash again. Who is mad at us that's knocking over our trash? Oh, there's a lot of people that don't like her. This Jason guy, Brandy... Up next after this household is the Brandy house. Brand is the Brandy household, the broke household. Hi, Arp Deco, and hi, Mystery. <laughs> um, hope you all are well. Have have good coffee and warm temps. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. Brandy is the household. She is canuts. Okay, we have to pick up this trash can. Clean up mess, and then maybe put the trash can inside and lock this gate just for now. It'll be annoying if I have to invite someone over, but for right now. Did she put it away? Oh, she's bringing it inside. Why? Whatever. That's fine. <laughs> I'm going to go. I'm going to a tabletop RPG night at the Silver Bar tonight. Ooh, that sounds cool. That sounds fun. Um, also, that's right. I forgot. Tiffany, last time we were playing, she got the want to marry a rich sim. How, like, who would that be? What if Tiffany is the one that steals, like, Mortimer when he gets older or something? Like, Tiffany survives the, the death. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. There's so many options. What are you doing? She's just, everybody's in here trying to sleep and she's trying to interrupt the baby. Stop. Go away. I don't know. It's it's 3 a.m. Why are you awake? 3 a.m. I don't know. Watch TV. Jennifer gets charged for her crimes and you put her in jail. That'd be fun. Jennifer... I guess then I'd have to make sure she does something more particular. What if... What if... What if Tiffany were to get... Oh, there's a penguin outside the house. What if Tiffany were to get sick and Jennifer purposely like locks her in her room and tries to kill her? <laughs> this is so this is so dark. <laughs> Hello, Pangy. Okay, bye. See you around. <laughs> See you around. He's lost. <laughs> oh, thank you. You like my pink hoodie? A lot I always get people mentioning my hoodie. Whenever I whenever I wear it, <laughs> I've I've had it forever. It's just kind of my random junk hoodie. Uh, does anyone online play D and I'm desperate to play or learn, but I don't have any friends interested. I bet there's probably some folks right here that play it. Rat fever, penguin checking things out. Yeah. Um, I mean, this is just strange town in Pleasant View at this point. Yeah, <laughs> honestly, <laughs> maybe that's the that's why everything's so cursed. Is she watching the Yummy channel? Oh, I wanted her to watch. Okay. She's so sad about the roaches. I feel like she blames everything on Jennifer, too. Like, how dare... How dare Jennifer let there be roaches in our yard? <laughs> and it's just like, what? Oh, she's gonna go clean him. They're not wearing a hoodie. They're experiencing pink soup. Yes, I have the pink soup. If your drone manages to save Tiffany for the, for the fifth time, Jenny locks him up. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> I feel this could get very dark. We could this is this gonna be like the burbs turned uh turned into like the 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 um the beaker household, like the beaker burbs. Like this is that's the vibe. That's gonna, <laughs> 
They can't pin the death on her, but they can pin her imprisoning her husband on her, though. <laughs> True. I know the dark storyline. Why is she just looking out the window? Do you want to go just like feed the baby, I guess? So yeah, we'll have to just like plan a wedding. We might have to like delete this for a moment and like put a wedding arch out here. I guess, I guess. Might be best. There's pee out. I assume this is dog pee. Oh, my partner's really into D and D. I went to watch a session before IRL, and it was I was so bored. Really not for me. <laughs> I'm also too awkwardly shy to think of things off the top of my head, let alone be weird and creative in front of people staring at me. Yeah, I I feel like that too. I'd be like, ooh, I don't know if I'd I'd be able to handle it. Into the night. Yes, she's thinking about taking her grandson and leaving. Um, do you want to just like go to the bathroom and take a shower? Why is this wall popped up? Evil and unhinged. Yep. There you go. Maybe also after Jennifer, after Jennifer, like, they get married, finally she'll put her foot down and make her move out. Like, if she were to get Tiffany to move out, where would, she, would Tiffany go? You know? Murder is the best hobby. <laughs> we are still- are we still planning Red Rum in this household? I'm on board. Yeah, we're trying to figure out the best way to- to get it going. To get it going. <laughs> oh, oh, we smashed that. Oh, Jennifer's up. Johnny boy, you want to, like, serve some food? Especially okay, yeah. Yeah, I guess it would have to be somebody who likes improv <laughs> to get into it. That's my issue. I'm really into trying d, &D but the improv, while sounding fun to me, makes me nervous. Yeah. I have that issue with different things, too. Evil and unhinged. <laughs> when I say evil and unhinged, I mean, like, I'm on my stomach in my bed, twirling my hair and kicking my feet. <laughs> exactly. Put that bitch in a home. <laughs> Are we gonna have a... God, a strange view retirement home? What is she looking at? What is she looking at? Do you want to call a repair person? Or j maybe John can fix it. <laughs> Wait, the burbs turning into the Lily's Garden ads? I don't know if I know what that is. Oh, the girlies are fighting. We're gonna, we're gonna insult and she's gonna argue. Or a drink. The <laughs> girlies are arguing. Oh, she like nodded. She's like, yes. Just with the sound of the broken sink so loud in the background. <laughs> Why? Why does it have to be so loud? It's like drowning them out. Oh my god. I don't like it at the end of the argue where they like start to get along a little. <laughs> The sink is like notice. The sink wants attention. Why do you keep looking at me, Tiffany? You know you want to. Macro unfriended. Let's just let him go at it for a minute while I pay attention to to Johnny. Uh oh, the baby just drank a gross bottle. <laughs> I've broken the sink. <laughs> I'm looking through Walmart in my new shoes. Uh oh, that sucks. Get the thousands in water damage. Gonna gonna argue. Yep. Okay, we're just gonna. I'm gonna stop this. We'll just. <laughs> John just like. Where are you going, John? He's just walking outside with his pancakes. John's doing everything he can to avoid this. <laughs> Welcome back, Toby. John's. Wh why'd you go around? Okay. John's like, I'm gonna go outside and have my pancakes in the rain. It's okay, I like soggy pancakes. The sink, the peeing sound of the PSP game. Yeah, being loud for no reason. <laughs> yeah, let's save. I guess. That's so hard of guard. Oh, that was weird. 
currency which has a similar vibe and makes me think this is horror filing might be a huge genre, a new genre of Jennifer meets all the Spectre and gets tipped on murder. True. True. Okay. Who's is that your your sweet escape? That's that's Jennifer's sweet escape. For her to, to work. And Johnny boy, I need you to try and repair this. I need you, I need you. Move. What is she the way she's like standing in the door with her hands open, just like following him? Wait, John is like, I'll eat my pancakes in the pouring ring if I can get away from my mother-in-law. Yeah, that's his mom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. He doesn't see his problem is he he loves them both and he doesn't want to understand that they're <laughs> that they're doing that they hate each other and doing bad. There's been a scientific research lately. After intense testing, scientists declare that The Sims 2 intro audio is louder than a rocket launcher. <laughs> and if played over the right speakers, it will break the sound barrier. Poor little Johnny. Yeah, he's he's struggling. Also, the baby, we gotta bring this baby back up. Hold. Or we could try and teach the baby stuff. I want him to learn parenting, though. We need to focus on that first. Bring the baby back up. Uh, how can I stop Sims 3 Sims moving out of town without... Hmm. I don't know. Do you... Do you mean, like... Like, random... I, I don't know. I'm not as good at the Sims 3 stuff. Yeah, you don't want to use that. Um... But they keep moving out. Yeah, so... So they naturally will leave, is kind of what it is. I don't know if there. I don't know if there's a way. Put put Bradley down. I don't know if anyone in chat might be has a suggestion. I'm not as good with some of the Sims 3 mod stuff or just like Sims 3 settings, unless there's like a standalone mod that might do it somewhere. The vibes in this house are so toxic. It's really it's really a mess. No, we're not doing that. We're gonna hire. Let's put away leftovers. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I wasn't I wasn't sure if, if they could move out Jeez, autonomously. Um Does it The only thing I could think of is that they're they're like moving to a different household so it looks like they've left or something. I don't know if that makes sense or if they're just dying. I guess the question is how how do you tell if they're moving? How do you see them moving out or, you know, Not sure. Oh, I I need to get the mod that stops the 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 shielding the eyes thing. I know there's one out there. It's always so goofy. Oh my god, she's gonna get sick out here. I need you to just come in here and hire a service. Because what would what down? Would they be? Yeah, what town are they moving to? That's true. The Sims are feeling their inner Animal Crossing New Leaf Villager moving when you don't want them to. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. Johnny's gonna come out and take care of his guardian. Um, no, exterminator. <laughs> Tiffany gets sick from nut. Yeah, we were talking about her getting sick, and then like. Jennifer purposely like encouraging her to do things that make her, that that try that uh force her sickness to get worse. <laughs> Good, let her get sick. Yeah. Um, I kind of want you to clean this. She wants to win a cooking contest. We could we could have her do a little cooking contest. Maybe she'll find some rich guy at the. The, the cooking contest place and she'll run off with him. Funny. Has lives long enough time to go. <laughs> Has lived long enough time to go, yeah. What a shame. <laughs> .org. <laughs> I feel like that's probably a place and I don't know if I want to visit it. Funny to chat.
The assistant coach has asked Jennifer to move to an upright piano for one of the senior players on the team. I don't know. I'm just going to make an excuse. I don't feel like reading it. I'm sorry. Jennifer has a sit out of the game. It is fine today's pay. Oof. You just like to lay around. Like, why do you just lay around, ma'am? What am I going to do with you, Jen, uh, Tiffany? I don't, like, know what to do with Tiffany. <laughs> I don't know. What? Yeah, you. Can you, like... Oh, my God. I keep hitting my microphone with my chin. Can you recycle this? Is there another... See, why does the newspaper keep getting put out here? I don't... I guess it's because I locked the gate. Tiff's going to die soon. Yeah, this is her 13th reason. <laughs> Read section. Food and dining. All right, John, John, Johnny's re, um, doing his garden. And then I'm going to get him to read a little bit. I feel like we should also have him teach the baby stuff. Like, I feel like he's going to be very on top of that. I have to try and make some progress with that. I'm very bad at doing the toddler skills, but... For right now, let's have you study parenting. Study parenting. As you can see, I'm oper operating with half a brain today. Same. I'm a, I'm a, I'm out of it. Wait, I clicked and it was nothing. <laughs> yeah, I think the the <laughs> the way it just makes links like that on mine it shows up as https slash slash. What a shame. <laughs> this hood needs drama. It has a lot of drama, but it's like a little bit of a slow burn, I guess. I don't want to. I don't want to like go all in out of the gate right now we're kind of building up i don't maybe tomorrow should be the wedding oh my god he, he learned good god he wants another baby another baby <laughs> she finds a sneaky elixir of life hi belly aches hello uh let's see i'm gonna get that thing that makes the baby smart Let's fill this dog's bowl. I do use. What's this baby's problem? He smells bad. Change Bradley's diaper. Not. And then teach Bradley to walk. Can I get some of that thing? The thing that makes baby smart? Yeah. <laughs> we need baby smart. We need a nut alert. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That new alert. You like that one? <laughs> Not. Not. Not the... What the hell is that? I love everybody slowly discovering the new alert. <laughs> that was pictures that I took during the snowstorm that looked like cursed found footage, so I edited Dreamer, the, the Calicundian sim, into it. Uh-oh. Yeah, it might Not. be on cooldown. There you go. Uh-oh. Zero inches wide? Fascinating. How does that work? <laughs> It was a real photo with me editing stuff into it, yeah. <laughs> Obviously, like, the sim was edited in, but it was a real photo. <laughs> you not supposed to... Not ha ha ha. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> not a ha ha ha. It looked like analog horror, yeah, that's... <laughs> that's what... That was the... Kind of the goal. Yeah, I shared the original photos. Um... I shared the original photos in the Discord, like, before I edited the Not. Dreamer into them. <laughs> They're just pictures of the snowstorm on my walk out to the barn one night after stream. <laughs> Dreamer crawled out of your PC and is now living in your barn. We we now, we know now. Yep. The nut is a single atom wide. Every time I hear the uncomfortable alert, I want to listen to him. <laughs> um, did you... Did we... Are we learning? Did we do any teaching? I think we got distracted. What are we doing? Not. Teach to walk. Not. Not. <laughs> your psychic advisor called. They said, don't do that to your nut. Don't do that, or your nut will nut that way. <laughs> oh. 
<laughs> Again, two inches. <laughs> Not. I have one inch wide now. Yeah. That's, pre that's better. That's better than nothing. Two by one. Okay. <laughs> Wise words. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's not focusing on washing the... I'm not. On teaching the baby. It's a little annoying. Maybe Tiffany and the dog need to go for a walk or something. I don't know. Oh, is that... Is Jennifer... Oh, Jennifer's back. Jennifer's back. I'm gonna temporarily delete this. Who's it? What kitty is this? There's a little cat. Is that Garfield? I think that's the kitty Gar. That's oh Brandy. A kitty named Brandy. John Burb family sim fail. Honestly, <laughs> hi Mal. Uh, a nut of chicken broth can really move a nut. Oh. <laughs> oh. Bringing nut soup to the next soup party. Wait, those two. Why do those two go go together? So. <laughs> oh Not. my god. Uh oh, twelve by six. That's a pretty. That's a pretty even. That's a good even measurement there. What am I doing? I'm getting a. Let's just get like a little classic deal here. We have a little bit of money to play with. We'll just get some cheapo chairs. What's like a decent looking cheap chair? I mean, I guess we could splurge a little and get the fancy these ones that are for the for the actual wedding. Who's going to be invited to the wedding? I guess we got to get Daniel over here because he's the brother. Technically, Mary Sue could come even though. She, oh, I forgot. I should have done these pink. We'll do pink. I don't know why I chose the orange. Bum, 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 bum. Balloon chairs. I think he's. I think the kitty is just chilling. Rain is so fried. I just tried to determine the symmetry elements in my nut. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> he heard there could be lasagna at the wedding. Yeah, true. There we go. We'll have our little. This is our little party. Oh yeah. We also probably need. We'll just put like the cake somewhere here. I'll use Not. one of these. I got recolors of this that are pretty decent. I like how when I'm not looking at the screen, I can see the chat move and then it just goes nut. Nut. And I know what's happening. I know what you're doing. <laughs> 20 by 6. Okay. <laughs> Welcome back, pair. <laughs> uh, they're going to replace Tiffany with the cat. Not. No one will notice. Overall, well-rounded nut. Yeah. <laughs> Eleven by six. You're getting some growth. I know who you are. What color is good? Her. And then I just wanted to get like a little bottle of wine. Um. There we go. John. Oh, the baby's sleeping now. I like the little PJs. These are just the random PJs he's got. They're like little sheeps on him. Now he wants, he wants to learn anger management. He's like, I'm gonna need it in this house. Tell a dirty joke. I don't know about that. Is she getting out of- oh, she's gotten out of the- you know what? Go for it. I was gonna have you just like do a wholesome kith. A little tender kith. Wifey? I wonder what they would talk about. Let's see. What, what do you think they're going to gossip about? Another day keeps the doctor away. At least Tucker is still a good boy. Yeah, he's like the only good boy in this house. Okay, he's, uh, he's gossiping about Kaylin Langerak. All the phone rings. Tiffany, answer the phone. He says, also, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. No, don't answer the phone. Just get some food. <laughs> Press X to kiss wife. <laughs> Tiffany, I'm asking you, I'm pleading for you. Oh, somebody, this is the Cassandra again calling for John. You know what? I'm going to say, yeah, that's, that's Cassandra. She's the one that called for John again last time. Like we were talking about how maybe, um, no, we're not going to do that. How about you just recycle? She was the one 
that um, oh, Tiffany, we, we were saying maybe Tiffany puts put her up to like calling to try and distract John from Jennifer, like she wants to get rid of Jennifer. Oh, I bet Johnny is really good boy when Tiffany calls him that. <laughs> I have severely mistyped. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm Jennifer. Okay, I was thinking that. Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna have you just stop eating so you can go talk to the phone. Talk to the phone. Talk on the phone. Jail. <laughs> now, now we're getting into some kind of like. Some some creepy like <laughs> I don't even know I don't even it's psychic damage. <laughs> Sandra is very gay in this hood, so she is hunting for a beard, maybe. Interesting. Well, this isn't Cassandra Goss. I should also clarify that. Oh, he's he's they're talking about makeup. They're arguing about makeup and fashion. Why does John constantly want to talk about makeup and fashion? This is Cassandra Howard. Who's this townie? I think she's from Strange Town. She he also has a want to be friends with Cassandra. <laughs> I believe the term is Frodi Freudian, Freudian, Freudian words. I would put myself in jail for that. <laughs> All Cassandras are gay. I don't make the rules. Good, good point. Okay, well he still wants to be friends with her. Can you clean up this and maybe just put these away? Where's the baby? Is baby still baby's awake now? Can we try to to? Teach baby. Also, did he successfully... Okay, he's successfully smart. Note to self, never make a dirty joke again. <laughs> you're all right. I didn't even get it at first because I didn't even understand what who what we were talking about. But you're talking about good boy? I'm guessing. <laughs> oh, oh. Why are we not teaching baby to walk? Go here. Is it too small of a space or something? Like, what's going on? Who that? Kirby. There's a dog named Kirby. It's like, I don't know if it's the space is too small. Let's hold Bradley. Oops, my chat's paused. I wish I was successful at being smart. <laughs> Let's see, are we gonna go teach the baby to to walk out here in the dark? Go here. Go take the baby out in the dark, cold backyard. Not until I get a functioning brain, yeah. <laughs> Nut butt spot. <laughs> uh, he had oh, John had to stop and talk about how hot his wife is. Okay, buddy. Teach to teach to Not. walk. Nut. Three by two. You know, I've seen worse, I guess. <laughs> Practicing Bradley's night vision. He says, okay, you you must you must learn. <laughs> you must learn. Teaching to walk in dark improves balance. Yes, but spot's very competitive. Nut to you, but spot. Oh my gosh. <laughs> BJ, thank you. We got the sub goal. 60, that's crazy. What's the music play? <laughs> thank you, thank you for the gifted subs. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. That's so kind. Congratulations to Token Funny and KJ McLean for some subs and emotes. Very nice. Thank you. <laughs> I wanted to help out. I appreciate it. I very much do. Like I, I literally just put the 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 sixty goal just as like a. So it would stop because my goal was just left at like 50 for a while, but it kept like re-hitting the 50 because that was just kind of seemed to be where it was staying. <laughs> now, so I just put it to 60 so it would stop doing that every time. <laughs> Anybody just kind of re-upped things. <laughs> also, that is my penance for texting and driving. Okay. Now 100. Oh, God. Oh, God. Where? I was... I'm... Uh, Jennifer? I think Jennifer's having a meltdown. Oh. The baby learned to walk. Well, that's something. 
Rumble? These two being forced to woohoo on the couch because wife because mommy won't let them have a, a double bed. <laughs> Hi Bradley. Nut. <laughs> Nut. Nut. <laughs> well, meanwhile, mommy's just sleeping. What happens if mom comes down the stairs? Birthy queen! <laughs> what if... What if mommy comes down the stairs and has a heart attack now? How do we feel about that? Oh god, look at Jenny's face. <laughs> She's like, I heard it from up above. The sounds she make? Also, yeah, I gotta run a dumb ad in a minute, but we'll we'll do this first. Hey, Crystal Beth. <laughs> Welcome. Uh-oh, she's running down. She's laughing? Wait, she's laughing? Interesting. Jenny, blink twice if you're being held captive. Let's see what happens. Let's do fright. There we go. Here's the, the moment. I should take a little screenshot. <laughs> Wait, this is great. Storytelling? Do not mess with my sons. I. <laughs> Save directly. There you go. All right. Uh oh, they're they're finishing very quickly. The dog came in to howl. Okay, now Johnny's gonna try and save mommy. You're gonna die up there. I'm Katya. <laughs> Johnny's gonna <laughs> Oh my god, the overlay. <laughs> that sound. <laughs> the the spam of sounds is wild. <laughs> the way Jennifer is celebrating, she is! She, you're right. Oh my God. Jo well, John's crying. Plead for loved ones. <laughs> He's, she, Jennifer's like, yeah, see, do it again. Try it again. Okay, it's a very tight space. Look at John's little face. He's a sad little guy. <laughs> Look at his little cheeks while he's sad. <laughs> he's got them little pudgy cheeks. <laughs> I know, it's sad. The doggy's howling. It's sad. Celebration cheer. She's sitting back down comfortably on the couch. She's she's lounging comfortably. Okay. She's taking a nap. Jennifer's taking a nap. This is so funny. Jennifer's petty. Okay. Let's see. The moment of truth. This is the honestly, this is the best sleep that Jennifer has had in 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 months. Yeah, I like I love Grim. Grim's cool. <laughs> Thank you for the seven stream streak. Good for her, honestly. <gasps> he lost. He lost. Oh no. <laughs> I said salutation. No, this is not Calicondia. This is more early Strange Town or Strange View. Early Pleasant View and Strange Town together. <laughs> Rip. Well, uh oh, the death of a loved one was was a big fear of his. Now he's like he's gonna be like aspiration failure. He's gonna go cry himself to sleep. <laughs> I wish I wish that we could like smash. <laughs> At least I can share a bed now, yeah. Dun dun dun. So long, you crusty <laughs> smash. <laughs> we we she earned it. Jennifer is the queen here. I don't know what happens if you actually smash it, but let's see. I didn't know it was a thing. I guess is that only a thing that you can do if you are enemies with someone? Pass. <laughs> smash vote. <laughs> smash nut. <laughs> Smash your patch. I want to. I, I think she should. Maybe save. Yeah, I can save. That's a good idea. Just in case it is weird. Yeah, this is. A, I think this is a store end table. I think this end table might be 
from the store stuff, I think. Good end table. I don't know if it says. I think I think it might be. Want stick, got stick, Jenny, let me smash. <laughs> Want stick, got stick. Why did I read it like that? Hulk, Jennifer, smash. She's so... Uh-oh. What? She, the baby's gonna watch. The baby's gonna see. Oh my god. Oh, he just... He just had like... Is that safe? I don't know. <laughs> Look at her. Wait, I need to take pictures of this too. Oh no, I'm hitting all the wrong buttons. The way she's just like... <laughs> Does it create corruption? I don't know. <laughs> I could always run like a hood checker or something. It still, I mean, it still gives me the option to mourn and have playable ghost. Maybe, I wonder if cleaning it up does? No, it doesn't. Okay. I think we'll, I think we'll just, uh... Here lies Tiffany Burb. I feel like I should put her out in the garden somewhere. John's gonna keep it out in the garden. <laughs> yeah, playable ghost would be funny, like she can't get rid of her. The problem is, is I think somebody, somebody might autonomously pick it up. Yeah, Tiffany Fertilizer. You can delete it, sell it, smash it, shit it. Is shit in it, nothing will happen. Okay. <laughs> Good to know I have those options. <laughs> Real talk, if I were John, I would break up with Jennifer for that. Yeah, maybe that'll start a thing. Maybe that'll start something. She's gonna put it out in the garden, and then John will see it. I'm gonna let... Well, John's sleeping right now. We're gonna... Uh... Okay, I guess I guess the lock when the sim dies, the lock resets. So she's gonna come sleep up in this bed. Also, this baby. I think I'm gonna be a cheater and just do this because I don't feel like waking anybody up. Oh, okay. Oh, that's cursed. Okay, so he has the memory of Tiffany dying. Picture <laughs> Jenny doing a line of ashes while John watches, terrified. She's got. A, that's what he said. She's got a taste of blood now. And she wants to invite someone over, go on a far east vacation, and play sports. Uh, what does he want? He wants to resurrect his mom. <gasps> I should keep that locked in. Core trauma unlocked. <laughs> I can see this as, like, a Blender animation. <laughs> oh, no. Jennifer was playing the long game. Yeah. I think we should keep that locked in. I don't know how he's going to resurrect Mommy. But he's going to do it one day. It is nice to have some better space in this, this room. I'm going to delete this for right now, because I don't know if we need it. Victoria Jenny doing a lot. Oh wait, I already read that. <laughs> Willing to to relearn Blender just to make this happen. Yep. <laughs> you know it's really feral when Crystal Beth says "huh" <laughs> to something. <laughs> you know it's really bad. <laughs> uh oh, he's having. Uh oh, Johnny's All having right. a meltdown. Where these are, these are some these are some storytelling photos. <laughs> All right. Well, I want to see that. There we go. Well. Okay. <laughs> Imagine if just a, a big scream fixed it all. 
<laughs> you can do a Norman Bates and put her corpse in a rocking chair. Wait. He's thinking about her. Wait, what if he runs down here and cries about her? We're being very... Wait, skip here. The only option I have is to go here or skip here. Johnny, Johnny's having a breakdown. <laughs> Johnny's, Johnny's gone. <laughs> yes, the, the, the Sims 4. I have the default, the full clay replacement set, so it does do there. <laughs> Johnny's skipping out to his mommy's grave. Put Tiffany in the doll. <laughs> Mourn. What is that sound I just heard? It's heard like a growling sound. Wait, how did she die? We had her, we kind of, we did a little bit of a forceful, uh, we, here, let's do this way. John, John and Jennifer I autonomously started woohooing on the couch. So I had, so I had Tiffany wake up and, and witness it. And then I force killed her by fright. So she got like f frightened. She got frightened to death. And then John tried to save her and failed. Johnny boy. He's very sad. I guess the sounds I'm hearing is just the grave. <gasps> Don't clean her up, John! Oh, Johnny boy! John just cleaned her up! John! John! <laughs> John! <laughs> In the trash she goes. What is it? Now, what the hell does that mean? Is that John? What if John's meltdown? <laughs> Yeah, that's what I was going to say. He's moving on. Thank you for the marker. Hopefully that hopefully it works. I haven't even looked at to see how the markers show up. <laughs> um, what if like John having the meltdown and stuff like made him snap out of it? <laughs> uh, and like he, now he's 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 beyond his mother, even though he still wants to. Maybe he'll just lock in baby. Horses, oh, you got don donkey pony time. <laughs> Whoa, those creatures. <laughs> yeah. Creatures. Creatures. Now he's just sleeping down here because he doesn't know what to do with himself. The baby's screaming. Baby's very upset. Baby's just kind of got to poop himself, though. You gonna get up and help the baby? He's still very depressed. He's a very sad guy. He will get married, though. I know, we can never empty the trash bin now. <laughs> um, Invite to join? Wait, there's an invite to join option on the baby. <laughs> like, hey son, come sit with me. Also, I gotta run a dumb ad. Uh, Let me run an ad real quick. I'll make sure not to do anything important underneath. <laughs> Not to put that trash bin in the graveyard, because it's her final resting place. Wait, that's true. Should I actually? Yeah, I'm about to join what? Like, sitting on the couch? In the haunted trash bin. I don't know. Can you just, like, go? Can you just go poop so that I can wash you? Please? There we go. Change diaper. He keeps the trash can by his bedside. Wait. You're right. Now his bedside's up here. We'll put it- he puts it underneath the little thing here. They could never get a maid. We'll put it in here so that it's like- it's hard to see what we're doing. It's like it can't be reached correctly. He hides it. Okay. Can we- Stroke. No, we need to pet. We need to. No, we need to f wash the child, please. <laughs> wash the child. Also, we can sell. Maybe sell these. Oh, this is a little. This is like a little door here. There we go. There we go. Jenny's already claimed the bed, yeah. <laughs> he never emptied it after the ashes went in, so whatever was in there before... I guess we just have to live with it. Yeah, the bed will be growing mushrooms. Oh no. 
Why do I have a pop up? I don't. Jennifer, ah oh yes, me and my husband in the trash can, possessed by his mother's ghost, says goodnight to every night. <laughs> life's a nightmare. Like how, speaking of which, I think John's life's a nightmare. He keeps showing little sad faces. What are you doing now? Tickle? I think you need to go to sleep, Johnny. You need to go to sleep, Johnny boy. There we go. I feel like I need one light on. <laughs> Everybody? <laughs> I love that there's always one person that says that. <laughs> what the heck is that? What was that? <laughs> I also would like to know. <laughs> I, I, I made a very nice edit of Dream of Dreamer the Sim. I always feel like I have to say the Sim. <laughs> Dreamer the Sim. <laughs> Into some photos I took of the blizzard. And they created that. Now it's me. <laughs> Bradley's first word will be I saw mommy snorting grandma's ashes. <laughs> a box of baby formula, a banana peel, rotten tomato, mom, coffee ground. <laughs> yeah. It's the my final form. It's just Dreamer. It's the thing that lives under our bed as children. It's outside the window. What? That's the reason you have to clo close your... <laughs> That's the reason you have to close all your blinds at night. So that it doesn't see you inside. You know? You gotta follow the rules. I'm gonna delete this. I don't like having... If I have, like, lights in here... I don't like having a above headlights. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> what? Isn't that... Don't y'all live with in the fear of, of always closing your blinds so that it whatever's outside can't see you? <laughs> or is that just because I live along <laughs> part of Appalachian Trail? <laughs> Some, someone gave me a subby! Yes, you got gifted a sub! I think it was DJ. DJ um, gifted sub. Make sure I'm not saying that. Yes, it was D DJ. Oh, Crystal Beth is here. <laughs> the the feral the feral gremlin, and feral gremlin one and two are here. <laughs> Fuck that! I have one window in my living room with no blinds or curtains. See, I can't do that. I can't do that. You gotta you gotta keep them closed. You gotta keep them closed, or else they're gonna see you. Yes, I do live in that fear. <laughs> okay, why am I just? I'm just kind of sitting here. I could be fast forwarding. I tend to do that. I'll just sit here and like, while the Sims are just doing stuff and not fast forward. Oh, she's here. She's here. She's awake. <laughs> she's here. <laughs> what are you doing? Eat. Um, probably not. How about clean up? I'm on the fourth floor, so if it wasn't an issue before, I do do not doubt for a second that Dreamer could climb up the yeah. <laughs> <laughs> stare at you. Exactly. There's a short curse that motion where it's called Windows, and it's about a granny lady who, whose care didn't close the windows and the monsters come in and get her through the window at night. <laughs> Ooh, spooky. <laughs> it's the things you don't see to worry about. There's a, a woods behind my house, and I'm afraid I'm gonna see something come out of it. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> did, did you tell Crystal about our plan to murder? We already successfully did a plan, did a murder. We did- we successfully did the murder, for now. <laughs> for now. Also, it doesn't bother me at all, but I always put the focus on Lear. Oh, okay, no problem. Which is my nickname- oh, nickname for Leah. What are you- uh, I used to- to want to be a, um, morning- a radio- oh my god, I can't read. Radio morning host. So DJ Queen became my tail. That's really cool. That's really cool. Okay, Lear. I'll remember that. I can put it. A, hopefully, it, sometimes it resets, but I can. I, it, it lets me like edit. Oops. There we go. Okay. Yeah, she died. I know it happened a little quickly. Happened a little bit quickly. Um. 
So we took a moment, a, a chance. So John and Jennifer autonomously started woohooing on the couch. And they were they were fooling around, and the mother was like mostly f full energy. She was upstairs sleeping, and we decided to have her run down and catch them, and then die of fear, <laughs> of a fright from seeing them. Hi, Morky. So she died of fright, and then we had John plead and try to save her, and he failed. That was my plan was that maybe he would be successful, and then we'd get to kill her again later. But um, it ju it just kind of happened uh we'll save <clears throat> and then jennifer smashed her grave <laughs> ding dong the witch is dead hello k-pop rules death by nut the uh jennifer smashed the grave and then john cleaned it up autonomously <laughs> so she's now in this trash can which john keeps next to his bed <laughs> she's in there <laughs> Please tell me you have the no unlink in delete. I probably do. I don't know. We were talking about it not being a, an issue. Like it's been proven that it's not corrupt. doesn't cause corruption or something. Uh oh, your, your phone died and I'm glad it only took a minute to, to turn it back on. Oh. <laughs> oh, me. <laughs> I only got Skylines working in my pleasant view. Very nice. That's good. That's good. That's right. You were having issues with... um getting them set up ruptures massively yeah um let's see the no the no unlink in delete i think it's a mod for it's a it's a mod that helps prevent some like possible issues with a with a with a um like a dead tombstone a sims tombstone being deleted or whatever it, it can help things with that no unlink on delete yeah Okay, we're gonna have to sort this out because this this is not it. Why don't I do this very quickly? Now that we kind of have more space. Oh, I me grabbing his plum bob. We're gonna put you all over here for right now. Also, thank you for the follow. <laughs> I don't know why, but Gunbot's camera mod got overwritten by the games. Oh, that's weird. The biggest fears are always make typos. Nut grats, Lear. <laughs> Nut grats. Should I... How should I do this? Well, I feel like we don't need a tub in this one. Let me... First of all, let me turn snapping back on because I had it off. I'm gonna do this. I'll just move that and then... This is going to go over here somewhere. Oops, that's the toy there, isn't it? And then I might just, like, take it in a square. I guess. I don't really know what else to do. Oh, we got a little thingy. I like I like doing little ba- I like the little bathroom details. Like, I didn't decorate this house, but I really like adding those sorts of things. What if I did... Maybe I'll do this. Bum, 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 bum. Oops. Nope, that's not it. There we go. We'll have a little bit more space to work with. Maybe got a Tetris room. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this so was April Black's video, and I think she said you don't really need the un no unlink mod to avoid corruption. It's only for resurrection purposes. That's it's important. Oh, okay. Oh, you had to explain Kanad Futa to your husband last night, and he was very confused. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> That's great. Um. Yeah, I guess that's kind of it. I feel like I... Maybe I could just bring this across. Bum, 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 bum. He was overwhelmed by the nuts. <laughs> oh. Oh. There we go. Maybe we can fit more, like, baby Ooh, stuff. Baby man. 
Canute our baby man. I was thinking about secretly changing the TTS voice to like something completely random and it being a surprise. <laughs> also, thank you for the biddies. Uh, no, I want a toy. I want a baby toy in here. Put this one here. Kind of a weird space, isn't it? Is this going to be like an issue? Should I? I probably could put this. Let's see. Like that. That'd probably be better, I guess. You know what? This this guy can go out here somewhere. I guess I guess. Send him a screenshot of what I put in Discord about Brandy broke kids saga, and he was like, "You're so dramatic." <laughs> That's funny. Um. There we go. I guess that might be a bad idea. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see if those work. Okay. Also, I forgot to bring everybody out of the garage. <laughs> Everybody's on the roof of the garage. Casually. There we go. Back in action. Back in action. Yeah, Bradley. Maybe Bradley will grow up to be a little park ranger. That'd be kind of fun. Oh, no, it's giving me that stupid glitch where I can't click who I want. Just go in here. I too enjoy being on the roof of the garage. Is John mad at Jenny for the death of his mom? I don't think she bl he blames Jenny for it, but I think there needs to be, once Jenny's up, I think there needs to be an argument, which I just realized she is up. There needs to be, like, an argument about her smashing the grave, because, like, nobody would smash it but her. What if Jenny blames it on the baby and says, it was, it was Bradley, he was downstairs, and all of a sudden I looked and he, and it smashed. <laughs> I don't know. A strange town ranger. Let's see, what, let's, um, let's have them argue a little. <laughs> We're being very, like, heavy-handed with the drama, but it's working. I think it's working for us. I too enjoy. Oh, wait, I already read that. Bradley will be the strange town ranger. Twas the dog, yes. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh, they're I like how they're, they're, like, yelling about the... This looks like they could it, we could say that's the urn. He's talking about the urn. <laughs> I'm missing some context. Is she a mean sim, or was it her enemy? It was her enemy. Um, so it was Je John's mom, Tiffany, was living with them. And she's she was like the mother-in-law from hell. Um, she wouldn't let them sleep in the same bed. She was just like in control of everything they did and just like didn't like Je Jennifer at all and would argue with her constantly. And um, so Jennifer said, okay, fine, we'll we'll sort this out. <laughs> Okay, they kind of... So you said lecture? I don't know if I have... I don't know if I have the lecture one. Um, doesn't really look like it. Was. Make sure you put past tense because she is past it. True. True. This is straight out of the... Out of I, Am I the Asshole on Reddit. <laughs> um... Yeah, I don't know. I guess, well, I think John might have, he might, she might have convinced John. Look, now she's going to sing to him and his little, his little himbo heart is going to melt. <laughs> his little himbo talk. Oh, it's under talk. Yeah, it doesn't look like I have it. I might, I don't know if that's only something for, unless it's a, either a mod or only something for like younger. Um younger people like him if he's talking to a kid or something jen would never post there because she doesn't want doesn't care that much maybe they're they're gossiping about herb they're gossiping about herb oldie with his fake mustache anyway should they they plan their wedding yeah i might not have it if is it is it a mod or is it just something that shows up at certain times Okay, are you? Do you not have to work today, ma'am? She doesn't. Okay, this would be a good day. Why don't I just go ahead and set up their wedding? I think Jennifer is going to plan it all. She's in charge now. 
So this is this is my house now, honey. Oh. Also, John is not in a great place right now. <laughs> John's in a rough place right now. Thank you for a, a lurk a clay crossing. <laughs> John's going through it right now. I want to take a picture. There we go. It's kind of not a great shot. Oh, uh, let's see. She, she, she's got to invite her brother Danny. Maybe Coral. She doesn't realize that Coral and Herbie are not a thing anymore. <laughs> I'm sure she does. <clears throat> Woohoo before marriage. I know they literally had a baby before marriage. Oh, okay, so it's kind of like the fight anyone mod. Okay. I woke up, yes, and uh, I uh, had breakfast, yes, go on. I uh, went downstairs, then uh, smashed her grave casually. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Herb Moldy. She'll she'll invite the, all the pleasants. I don't know who else we should invite. Sandra Goth? I don't know. I don't know that there's the Langorax? I don't know if they, they matter. Fluor? Flower? Homo. <laughs> One of them is a mermaid. Yeah, Angela's a mermaid. We'll invite Darren. I mean, not Darren. Brandy. Sure. <laughs> Flower who? <laughs> it was Homo. H-O-L-M-O. -O, homo. But it sounds just like you're saying Homo. <laughs> Flower Homo? <laughs> It's one of them neo names. She she named herself that. <laughs> She's changed her name. It's like one of those like hippies that changed their name into some like very generic nature name. <laughs> I'm Flower Homo. <laughs> Shit, he has to be gay now. <laughs> I like the idea to f of fight everyone, but not with autonomy on. Yeah, that's true. Unless you come up with a little story for it. Oh my god, everybody showed up real quick. Look at the girlies. Wait, look at I love wait are these oh yeah look at you can see Angela's fish scales she's a little mermaid yeah flower homo in decor not the dead buggies she's got a little black dress on honestly those seem like correct little dresses for them oh, who, oh brandy look at brandy I love brandy straight out of the trailer park she's straight out of the trailer park okay brandy Okay, and you got Herbal. Dar Daniel just showed up in this. Sir, are you not... At we invited you here. Are you leaving? What are you doing? You're not... You decided to not come. Okay, he decided to not come to his... To his sister's own wedding. Okay, and then Coral's doing the Coral thing. Yeah, she... It was... <laughs> we ended up having her be a mermaid. I, she got... She... It, it, one, at one point, she was... She was stepping on bugs, and the exterminator came over and just, like, sprayed her with bug spray right in the middle of her, and we decided she can, can, she turned into, a, like, a, a mermaid because of it. <laughs> I know that was, like, the worst way to explain that, but... <laughs> Anyone else feel bad when NP aging up NPCs and you get that sad, horrible pop about their life? Is not something I don't have that happen too often. Yeah, Daniel's like, what a drag. No thanks. Coral's outfit is wild. Okay, should we just go for it? We just can we um do you, I feel like I feel like Jennifer and Mary Sue could still have a bond. See if we can get a friendly hug. I need you to just power through. Where's Johnny? I think we need to um take the baby and make him happy and take him outside with us. This will make everybody happy. Are we not? Also, I realized that this is... We're going to unlock this. Nobody's coming in because this is locked. Um, are your Pleasant Twins friends? I don't... I think they're okay. I don't quite recall. What are you doing? Why are you going to play? Didn't, did she not hug Mary Sue? Also, look at Miss Mary Sue. Looking respectfully at Miss Mary Sue? 
Not her. Is she? What? I'm confused. What's. Ma'am? Oh. <laughs> I think it broke. I think this. We're having broken hugs. Oh. Okay. All right. I keep pausing every five seconds. Haha, <laughs> 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 uh -huh, where's Johnny? Oh, <laughs> made you think of Cyberpunk. I've never played Cyberpunk. Okay. Um, do babies? Oh, not plan every day. Can I click on this? Why can't I click on this? There we go. Oh, coral. Girls kicking butt. They're just the way that they're. Mary Sue's mortified, but Jennifer is so on board. Jennifer has is has a thirst for blood right now. Okay, we're gonna put Jen We're gonna put little baby downstairs. Yeah, Coral. Coral's getting it. Coral's getting it. Don't talk to Herb. <laughs> Who wants to talk to Herb? There are a ton of graffitis over the city that say that. Ah, okay. Okay, you're bringing the baby out? Oh no, the baby's stuck to him! Wait, the baby's stuck to him! Is he gonna have the baby stuck to him during the wedding? Herb the Prev. Herb the Nut. I know you meant Perv. I swear to God, it's just... <laughs> I'm... I... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Velcro, baby. Oh, God, here we go. <laughs> this is... What is... I feel like... I feel like this is... This is interesting because I feel like... Um... John was this close to, to his mommy, and now the baby is this close to, to daddy. You know what I mean? Like, they're... There's a lot of clinginess going on in the burb line. Oh, yeah. Also, I realized that Bradley's name is Bradley Pleasant because they weren't married when he was born. It's a new level of fashion. Everybody get out here. Is he here? He is there. He's there. Oh, God. His arms are so weird. Unhealthy attachments. Look at him. He's just there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <baby>. oh, no. <laughs> oh no! The way the baby was just on him. <laughs> oh no! I'm actually gonna um make it and take the other the other name. They're gonna I'm be pleasant humble. because Ma Ms. Ms. Jennifer is in charge. <laughs> it was so funny. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! I don't- just the way they- it just like leaned. The way that they just like leaned. Oh no. Oh no. I'm also gonna add my own marker. I haven't double checked to see if all the markers work yet. Okay, well... Yeah, now you put him down. Not clean up. Wait, why can't we cut cake? Did it go bad? Uh oh, the cake went bad. That's a bad sign. <laughs> this is a bad sign. Save. I should save too. I'll save. <laughs> what what would have happened if she'd left him? Oh the oh yeah, that would have been funny. That's that that's funny. What would the baby do? Yeah. These two are fighting. There's also a moment happening. I love... These two are fighting. Everybody's mortified by their fighting. And then Bradley's just strolling on by in the background. <laughs> There's so many screenshot moments happening. I need to get a good angle with Bradley strolling on by. <laughs> it's not a great angle. Thank you for the hydrate. I will I will save two. There we go. I'm gonna save. I know they're destroying the party snore that you're right. It was a bad idea to invite them for party score reasons. Everybody's mortified. She's gonna smash it in his face. 
Jennifer likes the feeling of the knife in her hand while she's cutting the cake. Imagine a child is enough. I was watching on our living room's chonky TV screen. It was hard to type in chat. Oh, no. Oh, she did a smoosh. Well, there we go. Everybody get some cake. Everybody get some cake. I don't really care about it. I didn't know you could cheat the party score, though. That's interesting. Is it like some? What do you type in to? Uh oh. It's chaos. The dog's barking aggressively at child. The dog's like, nobody's allowed in. <laughs> Everybody's trying to get in. Girl's in here eating chips. Where did Brandy go, by the way? Is she, like, still here somewhere? I think our trees need to be taken care of, too. Who's this Langerak walking by? I don't know. I guess did... Br oh, Brandy's out here. Floor cake. Yes, of course. One of them went bad, so I had to buy another one. J John, on his wedding day, sitting out here alone, eating his cake. Uh-oh, his garden is having a friggin' spray, I guess. Every everything's going downhill at his garden here. Click on the sim, I believe, and then set score. It also may just be for dates. Oh, okay. Honestly, I like it when it's a disaster. Yeah, it is funny. Hi, Gay Tarantula! <laughs> not, not butt spot. It's going pretty good. We're having a little bit of chaos. <laughs> just, a, just a healthy dose of chaos. In the... In the Burb household. The now Pleasant household. It's not even the Burb household anymore. The Pleasant name. I guess that's kind of sad. The Burb name might be dead. Brandy's also... sick. And hacking all over everybody. Uh, Nut is going. Nut it going. Nut it going. Burbs got dodoed. Yeah, they went extinct. Murder, assault, plague, the usual. Yeah. Meanwhile, this baby's having a meltdown. Maybe. Teach Bradley to talk? What are they doing? Make out ACR. He wants to make out. I guess I could let him do that. Oh, brandy squeeze. This, such a, this house is like very tight. It's very cramped. I could just like play with a stick. <laughs> the goodest boy is Tucker. And wait, the only burb now is Tucker Burb. Tucker's the only burb in town that's alive now. Tucker must carry on the family legacy. Is Tucker an elder? Tucker's an elder. I didn't realize he was an elder. There's fighting in the garden. They're fighting on our tomatoes. We're fighting on our tomatoes. Yeah, John is now. We, we deci I decided to. I wanted it to him to take Jennifer's name because I think Jennifer is the one in charge. She Jennifer wears the pants, so to speak. <laughs> That old, terrible saying. Give him the kibble of life so he never dies. You're right. Can I do that? Wait, this scene, Herb kicking Coral. The wedding party was a roaring success. Congratulations. <laughs> okay. All right. Damn, John, take care of your plans. I know, he's got to sort his stuff out. It's just, the way John's cheeks are, it just looks like he's always chewing something. Like, he's always chew working on something, you know? How do I get the kibble of life? Is it through this? Yeah, right here. Isn't this it? Oh, wait. I need to get this. Oh, it's green. Oh, I can't delete it in rewards mode. There we go. He wants to go on a vacation. That could be fun. He also, but he still wants to resurrect mommy. Should I keep that locked in? I don't know. Like, we're jumping around with what we think's going on. Because at first we were like, him throwing her away felt like he was getting over it. But then now he keeps wanting to resurrect her. He also wants puppies and kittens. Jennifer is very girl boss, babe, slay queen. Yeah. Slay stand. St I said stay slay queen. <laughs> yeah. Nuclear kibble. He's hiding frogs in there. Oh, no. You have to keep buying the kibble for the life of bowl from the aspiration word. You can't refill the bowl. Okay. 
I might have a mod that adjusts that though. Command to eat? Oh my. Oof, Dougie is rough. Also, child is rough? Child's okay, but somebody's gotta come in here and teach the child something. You're just lounging. Come teach the baby to talk. You're gonna like block this entire space. I don't know, should I? I don't know the a better option for stairs here, you know? Why is the dog food green? It's a the reward object? Um, that you buy out of the aspirations thing here. It's called the kibble of life, and it helps the pets like live longer. Tucker, I command you to eat. Hey, so are you trying to to um, guide early Strange View to ultimately end up being the canon? Not really. We're kind of letting yeah, we're letting different things happen. Like right now, like I just gave John and Jennifer the pleasant name instead of the burb name. And yeah, I'm kind of letting things happen. I like having things a little bit remixed. I like that idea. But I also am not like against. Yeah, no Lucy yet. Who knows? I mean, I know they're going to have more kids. Also, they want a puppy. And he wants a puppy. Should they get. He wants a kitten. I don't know. Maybe we should. Can I. Could I use the puppy creator to breed a puppy from, from Tucker? Can I, like, create a, a puppy? Also, we never did a, a toast, but I'm just gonna delete these. We'll give Jennifer her, her soccer thing back. Jenny needs her soccer. Where is it? Is it here? There we go. I'll do like that. Let me turn the lights on here. Oh, okay, you got- oh, so you have to manually- oh, okay. I can get the other one, too. I'm gonna give her, like- she'll have to get some sand out here. Hmm, I don't think that's the right sand. Maybe that. There we go. So I could also get, um... Bum bum bum. I want to get the the long lasting one that I have here. Maybe we'll put them both like out here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this out here. That's a good point. Should we redecorate? We don't have a lot of money. Maybe Jennifer needs to focus on getting um oh, <laughs> the dog pooping um maybe jen needs to focus on getting, making a bunch of money and redecorating now what's jennifer's style also what is she wearing for that's her oh that's her formal wear i didn't even, even pay attention okay the baby's almost learning because the baby's in smart mode lately been having a sims burnout i prefer to watch it mostly i get that i do that a lot with different games um, I don't know if I missed anything. I feel like I'm like in between. Also, yeah, okay, I missed. You have to, you have to command the pets to eat from it. Okay. What? I don't know what that sound was. Oh, is that her punching? Okay, she's gonna put him away. So he learned. So that's good. He learned to talk. Better forgive the earth tones. True. Just keep talking about how. Back in the day, the football soccer field didn't have AstroTurf, just gravel. Oh, my parents keep talking about. Interesting. So, you mean like, um, professional fields? Or just like, more like local fields. I assume you mean professional. Yeah, because that's true. They usually just have grass or the AstroTurf now. But yeah, I think, I think, oh, okay, the, okay, the baby's not. Jennifer, leave the baby alone, first of all. Put the just let the leave the baby alone. <laughs> You're driving me nuts. Uh, yeah, do you think Jennifer would do like more modern earth tone? I mean the house already has earth tones, but like more like modern stuff. She'd probably choose anything she thinks Tiffany would would have hated. That's probably everything she loves is what Tiffany would have hated.
Yeah, I gotta have the doggy eat it. He's he's in this filthy thing now. <laughs> My burp house has a lot of greens and is an old fashioned. Okay. Yeah, green is also good. That's why I kind of want to give John a green shirt, but I think the red is supposed to be a nod to his Sims 1 outfit when he's a child. Nut house. My nut house has a nut of greens. Oh. And wood. I see a lot of wood tones, yeah. They live in the highlands in the middle of nowhere, so the field have non-injury causing coverage is a relatively recent luxury. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, because I think, I mean, around here, any local, like, school fields and stuff are just regular, real grass. We don't have, like, astroturf or anything, but, like, the professionals would have astro... Well, I think a lot of the professionals here have actual grass that's taken care of, at least in, like... I guess it depends on the sport. Honestly, Jennifer is giving the type of TikToker who goes and turns a very colorful and fun bathroom into a mute ground. You're right. Like a cute little, like, kitschy, like, like, kitchen. <laughs> and then they turn it into the most, like, depressing, all white with hints of gray room. <laughs> I hate those. <laughs> I hate those. That was at my, de at my dentist's office. They have a, a TV, and they always have, every time you go in, they have, um, like that, the channel that's just, like, all videos of all videos of like uh people making over house like house flipper type stuff um always on i don't know what it, what the actual shows are called if it is it hd tv or something like that and it's always like i was watching them the other day when i was waiting in the waiting room and it's like every single place they do a makeover of it's just like we made everything white <laughs> and it's like like it hurts your eyes to look at it <laughs> i don't know i don't like it yeah, she could be a beige mom. Yeah, honestly, the, the brown... For me, earth tone is, like, green and g brown and stuff. Oh, John. What what happened? Also, I wasn't paying attention. What the hell is John doing? Why is all the... I think John's, like, having kind of a meltdown. John's just, like, things are not right for John. <laughs> my, my, my doctor's office does the Sam. Does the same, yeah. It's weird. Beige mom. <laughs> yeah, Jennifer's just gonna be like the most unseasoned beige mom. Mm. You want to follow a TikTok that's pretty exclusive thrift and DIY projects are very colorful house. I recommended Birdie Wood. That's a fun name on TikTok. I like the name Birdie. Um, the house is messy. You should get a maid. True. Can they afford a maid? Does this seem like a house that could afford a maid? I'm letting Johnny... Jo but also, like, John is a stay-at-home dad. You know what I mean? <laughs> I don't know if I'd get a maid because, like... Jo what are you doing, John? You know? Actually, I might have him macro clean right now. John is a maid. He's literally the, the male wife... Maid daddy. <laughs> daddy maid. <laughs> That's John. The maid may take out the trash, Tiffany. Oh no, the nut may nut out the trash, Tiffany. <laughs> but what? <laughs> but what, please? He wants to grow up well. How many days? Three days. Oh, he stank. We gotta get a potty up here, too. That's the other thing I haven't had yet. Maybe I'll have John stop and try to teach him to go at some point. Oh wait, I'm in the wrong section. Per usual. <laughs> Well, butt spot. <laughs> For a second, I thought you meant the doctor's office does kitsch camp. Kitsch, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Kitsch camp <laughs> with lots of green and pink. <laughs> it's funny. Uh, What am I trying to do? I also never used this one. Look at this one. I never used this one. There's some different colors. Is this the is this the Jennifer aesthetic? Maybe we should use as much money as we can to like make over one of the rooms. We'll make over the kitchen. And then slowly keep making over the house. Just a, a, a solid white, or maybe just like this little brown. <laughs> I'm here! Welcome, Foxglove. How are you? 
is the cutest set of chairs that are all painted to look like food brands. I that sounds familiar. That sounds very familiar. I feel like I might have seen their their stuff before. Um Yeah, I would love to be able to do that. Like I don't even know where to start to have like a really cool, fun, colorful space. It's just like I don't even know where to start. Like maybe just like cool, colorful bedding to start with, and then like going from there. Definitely we're getting, oh yeah, we're decorating the master bedroom. Yeah, the weird thing about the master bedroom is like this space here is I think this is supposed to be left over from the dad. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Let's make over the master. She's getting up. Never go do stuff. We need real life CC creators. Yeah, let's I know. See, that's the biggest thing, is like it's so expensive. Like Nut glove arts. <laughs> Not the nut glove arts. <laughs> oh no. You've been cursed. You've been cursed. Uh, I want more deep dark moody aesthetic. Like lots of muted royal tones, like deep purple and emerald green. Ooh, I like the sound of emerald green. Yeah, see that's my issue is like I love earth tone stuff and then I also love like bright and fun stuff and it's like I can't choose one or the other and I'm very back and forth and I don't know <laughs> I don't know and right now my my room is like all white the walls are all white and then like this one wall beside me is like dark gray <laughs> which I did when I was younger and that was like I gotta be careful not to delete oh god this is stankin oh no I gotta remember to put this in a- in the- you know what, I'm gonna leave it right there so I don't forget it. We're gonna get rid of these awful curtains. Yeah, that's- that's true, mixing aesthetics, but like, how do you mix, like, earth tones and, like, funky, colorful stuff? Tiff is rotting. Honestly, she was already rotting. You know what I mean? Like, she was already a rotted woman. <laughs> this is just her true self coming out. <laughs> I think it's nice to use the bright colors as little pops. True. Brown with green from John's Garden Love. I think that she's going to do like obnoxious, like everything inspired by like the HGTV or whatever. <laughs> I think that's her, her aesthetic. I don't know. I feel like I want to change the color of these windows, though. Can I just make them white? She's just going to use too much white. And just everything is white and gray. I think that's the Jennifer. Or maybe white with a little brown, because Jennifer wears a lot of brown. <laughs> the new urn suits her more, yes. Millennial gray Jen. She's going to be like millennial brown. <laughs> millennial brown Jen. Oh god, look at the white. It's begun. <laughs> the green is the stink of mom's dead corpse. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we gotta put. We gotta find a good place to put mom. We gotta find a good place for mom. Wait, isn't that a- wait. That's the name of a- Um... The- uh, There's a place called A Place for Mom. It's a- it's like a- It's like a, um... Oh my god, like a retirement home. <laughs> oh no, the- What- Why did- What spot caught the word shag? It's literally shag carpet, okay. No mold crowding, no character, not even multicolored shag carpet. Yeah, just, just the most generic. An old, yeah, an old folks home. It's, it's here in the United States. It's called a place for mom. And I just, I always hear that, and I think that's like such a sad name. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you know what she's gonna do? She's gonna do like a cold wood, like not a fun warm wood, like a cold wood. I don't know. That's a weird one. I think that one's facing the wrong way. It's, it is sad or weird even. Yeah, I don't know. Hide Tiffany under the house. True. Oh, the white. Wait, the white wood? Um, I, I like a nice hardwood floor, but that would cement the sterile, bland, trendy, minimalist, monochrome look. Yeah. I feel like <laughs> it looks like a dentist's office. Oh no. This is what this is. It's like a... We're trying to make like a caricature of the basic generic room. 
basic generic style. Yeah, the floor is this a really nice. I think this is one of the. Is this one of the Animal Crossing floors? Yeah, this is the one that Mad Rain converted from Animal Crossing. There's some really good ones. It's funny recently because I've been playing a bunch of Animal Crossing. I keep seeing these floors like in Animal Crossing, and I'm like, oh, I use that. And, oh, that's from The Sims. And I'm like, no wait, it's from this. <laughs> Hello, Poppy. <laughs> dun dun dun. Um... <laughs> Is she gonna use this one? I never use this one. I feel like this one's too fun and cutesy. That's true, everything looks- yeah, it's round and bubbly and cute, yeah. How can I remove the censored chat bug? Yeah, I think- yeah, like Bagel Swag said, it's- there's a filters option. You know, ac and H stealing Sims designs. What a world we're living in. Imagine you're enjoying streaming and then you look up and see that looming in your hallway. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> that's terrible. In the little cog icon, enable chat filter. Yeah. I've never had it on, but I hear a lot of people end up with it somehow by default. I, I Sometimes on mobile. I never use this bed enough. This is the white one, white with blue. I don't really like the blue for her. I guess not. I'll probably just use the IKEA stuff, right? I already grabbed that one. Use this one. <laughs> you turned mine up on purpose. <laughs> of course you do. <laughs> Hi, antisocial elf. That would be my bedroom. Mine is grandma's ashes. Yeah. <laughs> That would be my nut nut minus grandma's ash. <laughs> Love the stink. I know the stink cloud looming. Wait, where did I? Oh, grandma's over there. God, I'm not focused right now. I'm not focused right now. We're just going to do the most basic, depressing, generic Luke. Oh my God, please have mercy. Should you just have an all white? Like, <laughs> this looks like now, you know what this looks like is like the the hospital scene of some kind of machinima. <laughs> They're like in the machinima, the Sims 2 machinimas. This is the hospital scene. <laughs> so clinical. I don't know if I want it. I think I might want a little something on the bed though. Maybe we should do the gray. You're going to sleep in that sun? I know. Mm -hmm. These are all too fun and colorful. <laughs> you dare encounter it upon me? <laughs> How dare. Well, this one's a little bit better because it's like, it's not as blinding. No color, no life, no deco. Stanky brown. You think, actually, I think I have a, do I have a brown of this? Oh yeah, look at that. That's like baby poop brown. That's like baby poop brown. Everyone doesn't want to nap because he's trying to watch the stream with me. <laughs> That's cute. Good thing he has no concept of what we're talking about. <laughs> of anything we're talking about. <laughs> what do we... Ha I don't know if I have a good... Oh, there's this like tan. Oh, I do have these. Oh boy. We're talking about baby poop. I think he understands. That's true. He probably understands that much. <laughs> okay. We could just do the gray. I feel like the gray is easy. Is an easy option. But like Jennifer's thing is brown, you know? So that's why I want to do the brown. Maybe I will do a different floor. I'm spending too much time worrying about this, but ugh, what is that? Oh, it's like a it's like a press board floor. Olive's doing scratchies. Yeah, I think maybe a, maybe that's what I need to do is like a brown rug. Let me see. Oh my god, Olive. Debbie. Puppy. Just going nuts on the bed right now. Scratch, scratch, scratch. Just need like a big 
plain... Big plain something. I don't know if any of these are plain enough. These are all too fun and exciting. I guess maybe I could use one of these. This reminds me of how I downloaded a build and recorded a GTA texture pack. Conversion of floors and walls so I have icky broken floor tiles and fl <laughs> Oh, that's funny. That's great. I like that. That, that, that. that sounds like it would be fun to have. I like having that kind of option. Oh god, that's a, that's a color. We have like a good brown. This is like a muted brown. <laughs> Interesting. Maybe I could change the bed to sort of go with that a little bit. Maybe I will just go back to the white bed. We're kind of jumping around. <laughs> I don't know how you can download them though. I can't remember what build they were from. Oh, okay. Oh my, this is it. Super desperate muted colors, yeah. Let me give them some end tables. Also, I might we might do a little break in a minute here. Do a little BRB. I have to do ads in a little bit, and then we could um we could uh can I I can't bring it up or down, but we we could watch a little min machinima. I have a feeling, see, I'm going to say this and then it's not going to matter. And I say, I feel like I say this all the time. But I feel like stream's not going to be as long today because I'm so, like, tired. <laughs> but I say that and then, you know, <laughs> you know, we're going to end up with seven hours. I'm going to blink and it's seven hours. How about that? What do we feel about mommy? <laughs> mommy on the end table. But I don't- I need a picture of mommy. What are these items raising things? Uh, yeah, they're called OMSPs. They're called OMSPs. They're a very- they're a very popular, uh... <laughs> a very popular, uh, thing for building. Why are we- why are we blocking the trash or putting it there? So... <laughs> So Jennifer smashed the grave. Jennifer slashed the grave, smashed the grave of John's mom. And then I had John mourn the grave. And then he picked it up and threw it into this trash can when he threw it away. So he, th he threw it away into this trash can, which I didn't really want him to. I wanted him to keep on, keep holding on to it. <laughs> So the yeah, the trash can is sacred. It's sacred. It's got mommies in there. <laughs> mommies in there in the coffee grounds. <laughs> mommies in there with the coffee grounds. Trash plus mommy. I did see that. No, you're okay. <laughs> I never know when folks are coming in. Um, I feel like we need like a little flower. The amount of time it's taking to just do this quick little minimalistic beige mom makeover oh she would have these these right she would have these like over here the littlest bit of green oh wow <laughs> that's where we're at is this this little flower mm. i have a lot of like flowers that you add into like pots on your own i don't really love them you know what I'll do? I'm gonna use... Do I still have it here? I set it over here. This is the... It's actually the lot debugger. But it looks like a flower. I'm gonna put that there. That's her flower. But I gotta remember that that's it. Amazing decor. Evokes so many emotions. Now I'm questioning this. I think we're actually gonna do... A lamp. Do a singular lamp. Now, I love my mom, but... <laughs> sacred trash can. Yeah, like disgust and nausea. Yes. What kind of lamp goes in here? Like a generic like this, but in white? Is that what happens? Oh, that little guy? Maybe that little guy? 
This is honestly the wait, but like the all white with a trash can and a flower is kind of something. Like I think we're on to something. <laughs> I think we're actually on to something. Does Jen know his mom is in the Jen know mom is in the trash can? I think I don't know. I think she might. I think we decided. Um, stinky crash on it. Yeah, it might cause errors. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> I don't know. They haven't touched it yet, but it very well could cause some errors. And I'm just gonna get him like a really basic IKEA thingy. I guess this is like their best bet. I'm gonna put like two next to each other. Maybe like that. Makes like one big one. There's like a little bit of flickering, but you can't really see it. The IKEA front page catalog has arrived. Then like a mirror. I always have this thing where like the mirrors slot into the tops of these and it drives me nuts. I think I got I downloaded something that makes it so that these can have like different looks to them, yeah. They're just like plain. Gotta be the white. It's gotta be the white. Oof. Oh no. <laughs> and that's her. Oh geez, those are flickering bad. I can't do that. I guess, well, I guess when you don't click on them, they aren't. I guess when you don't try to click, it's okay. Look at this room. Mmm, <laughs> sterile, my favorite. <clears throat> they still got five grand from deleting all that crap. Oh, I also didn't put blinds. Somebody opened all the windows. You know what? Honestly, they probably need all the windows open in this room <laughs> because of the smell of mom. <laughs> of the smell of mom i think we'll just do we'll just do these i really like these this is a custom blinds fitted blinds will fit any window they're made to go in i don't know where they're exactly from but they're made to like go in the wall so they kind of fit like in just about any window you're gonna die up there i'm katya <laughs> i can't remember where they're from they're called fitted <laughs> I might have to edit the sucking out of that eventually. We should have probably changed- oh, you know what we should do? Is change this door to something more depressing. I hate that. <laughs> the slurp's funny and then it's like, okay. What's the most- what's the depressing door? I had to know- you know, I appreciate- I like the first half of it. I might have to edit this- this- the slurping part though. Olive, you're okay. You don't have to bulk. Just flimsy base game door, true. Tiffany smoothie. I hate that. <laughs> the slurp <laughs> does make me want to hydrate, though. I hate the... Oh, you know what I'm going to use? I'm going to use... Oh my gosh, Olive? It's okay, puppy. Olive has something to say. I'm going to use this one. Got the doorknob. Got the depressing door. Oh god. Should Jennifer's outfit now reflect her new changes, or should she stay brown? I like the brown on her. Olive's a spoiled little brat right now. She's made herself a little spot on the bed. She's using my pillow, and she has, like, the bank blanket up around her, so she's, like, all cozied in with a pillow and a blankie. <laughs> she's just chilling. Ceiling light, true. I could I could add it. I hate using ceiling lights in the rooms because I like the lighting better. But also, I could see this room having one, maybe a lamp, maybe a floor lamp over here. I prefer like wall lights or lamps in the rooms. Maybe like this one. No, that one's too fun and quirky. <laughs> okay, dreamy. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck at work. Or like, what's this one? This one doesn't have a white recolor. Oh, this one? Maybe that one. That's their one hint of, of character. There you go. Oh god, it's so bad. <laughs> Look at it. 
<laughs> oh no. I remember a uni girl being so mad because I was willing to defend brown as a favorite color when it isn't even my favorite color. Like, honestly, let Jennifer be an unapologetic favorite color is brown girly. I like, I, the thing is, is I like brown in the right circumstances. I'm also noticing that her dress has always got like these, her legs have these cuts in them. You see the, the leg cuts? It's Ikea. Is it, you know, it's not a CC dress. I think it's a... I think it's a store dress, but I did... The version that I think she's wearing is like a top and bottom cut. I don't know. Let me let me do something. Gussy up my clothes every day. Also, let me save. Just in case my game explodes. You should have gone with the 70s platform shoes trousers, yeah. I think this feels very business mom, though. Let's look at the full body outfits and see if I can find that. Because I think it might be like a full body outfit. Yeah, I love the Gussie Up mod. Oh, wait. All white mommy? Hmm. Oh, yeah, see, these are some versions of it. But I think these versions don't have the enhanced chesticles. Also, I gotta run a dumb ad. I think we will take a machinima break in a moment. Maybe at, right after the ad ends. Need enhanced chesticles. Thank the sun god for the gussy up mod. I just made Angela the cutest new BFF. <laughs> yeah, I really like it. I like the one that separates it so that you can choose like only everyday make makeover. Excuse me. I do like that part. Also, these I feel like could work for her, like this brown. This one she has as her formal wear. Me having visceral reaction to chesticles. <laughs> you don't like, you don't like enhanced. You think I should, should I just say boobies? Enhanced boobies? The boob, boob enhance. Boob enhance. This is her, this is her era where she's. She believes she is the queen of Pleasant View. <laughs> Boobage, boobs, cleavage. But that's so expected. <laughs> Enhanced bubs. Disney's shoulder pads, true. Oh yeah, see here's here's the one she's technically wearing, but it does not have enhanced boobs. But it's not bad. There's also a beige mom version. She's wearing a, an altered version. Yeah, that does. That does. I don't know. I think... I don't mind what she's got on. I feel like she could also work with something like this. This could also be the look. Uh-oh. You gotta, you gotta take your meds. Are you able to still take them, or do you have to wait? I don't know that we have anything with with enhancements. I I guess I'll just stick with what we've got. I might just I don't know. I don't know. See that when she's standing, it's okay. I was gonna see what I was looking for is if we had a full body version with with the enhancements. <laughs> But it doesn't look like... Oh, God, I'm hitting the mic. doesn't look like it. When she stands, it's okay. It's when she sits. Oh, wait, wait. One sec. No, he he's hungry. We're going to say command to eat. And then we're going to clean. Tucker, come here. And we also got a filled bowl. What's the dog? Why did he... Why is he sad? Daishi. Daishi. She says, come, eat the good food, good boy. Maybe they can fix it. Fix it. Yeah, I don't know. I think I I think I think probably... This one I probably downloaded from, like, the repository project, because since it's just a store edit. Yeah, the pupper house needs to be clean. Okay, she's going to sit here and watch him eat. Why does she have to smile like that? Look, okay, he sparkle. He sparkle. 
What's that do? That makes him... Okay, that brings him to the beginning of his life stage. Okay. That's cool. I like the Sims 3 that we could be the pet. Yeah, true. I do have the mods that let you, like, control the pet. But, um, with this, you're not allowed to. You have to have them... them do it. She's stuck in creepy doll mode. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you don't trust the mods? Oh, like the... I mean, this one's just like something I typed into the the startup cheat. It's just like an in-game cheat. Um, and you just enable it. What are you doing, John? Oh, no. He's trying to take... He's, he's out here starving to death trying to take out the trash. No, John. <laughs> John, no. Yeah, it's, yeah, we'll see. If that keeps being an issue, we're gonna have to figure something else out. I could also, like, like, would I get, a, could I get away with... Oh god, look at this room! It does look like a medical facility. Like, could I do... Like, something, let's just do like this to make it look like it's a plan, but then it actually, like, makes it so they don't really pick up on this? I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, they chill out a little bit, and it just looks like a weird design choice. Yeah, I know. Like, this this nice, this warm family home. And then... <laughs> this. <laughs> it's wild. Does that work? Like, they think it's in another room? I don't know. It works with sound? Jennifer is also... Jennifer. Um, <laughs> I don't know. I just wondered if maybe it would stop them from being annoyed when they enter the room. We'll see. Might not work. Why is there a trash can on the bedside table? That's a loaded question. <laughs> That's where mommy lives. <laughs> Mommy's in here. <laughs> uh, Jen John's mom, Tiffany, died, and then Jennifer smashed her grave, and then Johnny cleaned her up. And, and put her in this trash can. So mommy's ashes are in the trash can. Thank you for the follow, Jess. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. <laughs> and now his mommy is this trash can. And he keeps her... He keeps... He turned her into Oscar the Grouch. That's Honestly, she was already there. She was already there. Mentally. But so yeah. Now he keeps her on the bedside. We're hoping that it'll work. I don't know if it's gonna work. John's about to pee himself. I feel like John's only ever making pancakes. Oh, <laughs> that me out. Mommy lives here. <laughs> this is where mommy lives. Every time he does anything, he stops to admire his wife's attractiveness. It's really funny. Like he's constantly in the middle of doing things and he just stops and goes, my wife's hot. <laughs> Maybe the trash mom needs a separate shrine room. That's true. And he can pray. <laughs> That's true. He needs a shed. Wait, he needs like a, sh a shed for his garden. I know, she's, he's not wrong. He needs a garden shed. Out here. But it's actually, it's like, it's like, like some Jason Voorhees style, like, <laughs> the mommy shed. Sometimes pick up bowls and to fill it with food, they'll place it down again. The wall, um... Yeah, it's annoying the way the the wall the sometimes it'll turn around. Why is it so filthy? What are you doing? Do you just stood back up? John John just panicked and peed himself. He sat down on the toilet. Okay. Now he's going to sleep. Sir, can you actually take a bath? He got off the the now he's crying. John is really going through it right now. John's so sad about this room. Look at how, look at how horrible this room is. Okay, you need to change the baby's diaper. I think we need to try and use our money. Let's use our money to try and make over the baby's room too. And then we'll... Oh, I also keep forgetting we were gonna... I'm gonna do a machinima. Let's see if we can... This is this poor baby. No color for baby. 
Oh no. We already got this going on. We'll just do a quickie. The creative draining process has begun. This poor child. No plants. No, I feel like there should be some plants, because that's... I feel like John's influence is plants, right? I'm just gonna delete that. That's good. I'm just gonna do the basics. I'm gonna recolor this. Ba -ba -da -da. I thought you were gonna say make over the baby for a second. I just thought of those Instagram Alpha CC babies. That's funny. Some of those are kind of scary. They're like very scary. I know at least the xylophone has color. I might have a custom xylophone with recolors. I can't remember. Oh, we gotta get the baby one of these. Now that oh yeah, look at this this gray toy box. Look at this uninspiring gray toy box. Oh no. If we could, well, actually, if we potty train the baby, we won't need a, the, the changing table. So I could just, like, put this here. Um, I'm gonna do... Let's maybe a different plant. Did I just use the same awful rug? <laughs> hmm... How do I make it work in this room? What if I do like this? Oh. Is that weird? I don't know if that's weird. <laughs> or I could do it this way. Kind of interesting. Maybe it's too interesting. Maybe that's the problem. Redley will... Uh, Want to stay at school at this point. I'm sure he'll be more inspiring you furniture there. Yeah, exactly. Oh no. Um something on the wall would help. <laughs> but we do we don't want help. But yeah, I think I sh I could put something on the wall. Let me find like a really plain plant. This is Jennifer's plain mommy era. Some cacti for the baby. Yeah, Jennifer Jennifer chose the cactus for the baby. <laughs> yeah, we want... Jennifer is going through a, a phase right now where she wants everything as bland as possible because she knows that Tiffany would hate it. Tiffany being the dead mom that she kind of wanted dead because they were fighting and stuff. <laughs> if only there were color colorless toys. Honestly, there probably are out there. Let's find the most color colorless painting. Oh, here we go. One little doggy painting. One little doggy picture in black and white. And then maybe... Should I get this one again? We'll have the same floor lamp. He does have this one. I guess I'll keep that there. There you go. This poor baby. <laughs> the black and white picture of Tucker. What are you doing? How is the baby? The baby is filthy. Let's see if we can get her to just like potty train him a little. Okay, wait, let's change his diaper first so he doesn't have a meltdown while we're trying to potty train him. Yeah, I gotta I bet I could find some plain white toddler toys. Morse, thank. Got a little, it's got a little style. I don't know if he's still smart. I think it's the, the smartness stays. She wants to buy a sculpture. That's probably her, that's. I feel like this is her wanting to continue making over the house. We still have pretty good cash. We're not doing too bad. Maybe I'll just slowly make over this upper level. I'm gonna save too. I'm stretching. Also, I think I missed a hydrate way earlier. Literally 50 minutes ago. <laughs> Oops, sorry. 
Yeah, you, I was just about to say we could watch a machinima. I was gonna try and dig up some um other ones here. I have a question also. So early Pleasant View is set later than early Strange Town, right? Yes. The creator suggests that you add them like if you wanna play them both in like an Uber hood. The creator suggests you play early Strange Town for like a couple of rounds before you add Pleasant View. Because like Strange Town starts in like the 80s, but Pleasant View starts in the 90s ish. And so I ended up just by chance. Originally, I was just intending to play early Strange Town on its own. And then uh, down the line, I decided I did want to add early Pleasant View. So, but it kind of worked out that I had been playing it enough. That it kind of they 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 synced pretty well. They're probably not perfect, but they did sync pretty well. I'm gonna adjust my little microphone here. When the room is that white, we can see more stank. It's more true. It's more gross. Yeah, I think it seemed like it worked out well. Okay, so we have a couple of little sh little short ones. I think we have seen this one. This one looks familiar. Vampire Academy seems fun. Um, this one also looks very fun. Um, there was a couple up above that I did want to... I don't want to forget some of the older ones up here. I, I scrolled for a little ways. What did I see? Um, we haven't watched, like, this one. Snow Witch? I feel like we did watch the Snow Witch. Oh, there was this one we haven't watched. Uh, this one also. This one's only four minutes. Yeah, the Carter Sims one. We didn't watch Snow Witch. Okay. Yeah, I think I was. Yeah, I was kind of going by from this point onward. Do you have any personal gameplay rules regarding the elixir of life or who and when they can use it? That's a good question. I don't. I don't really personally. I feel like I just play. However, the storyline works. You know, like I make up little storylines as I go. And if it makes sense for somebody to somehow have acquired it, then I go with it. Uh, yeah, we need a spreadsheet. You're right. Also, hi, Dynalone. <laughs> Playing off vibes. Yeah. Like, like in early Pleasant View, Mortimer technically is like the inventor of the, of the, that stuff, whatever it's called. Um, the elixir of life, um, is, was invented by Mortimer. So it's like if you were playing early Pleasant View or even just general Pleasant View, you could be like, okay, who's friends with Mortimer that could get some, <laughs> you know, that could get their hands on it. Something like that. Um, did you ever go around to Mortimer's Revenge on Dina? Um, I did in a way, but yeah, that one, unfortunately, Strange View right now is pretty much done. Normal Strange View. Um, at this point, I don't think I'm going to go back to it. I've just been it's been so long running that it's just like I'm kind of over it, <laughs> unfortunately. Um, but yeah, there I think there if I recall, there was some things that happened with Dina. Yeah. I don't know what I we watched this one. I don't know what I want to watch. Maybe I will watch some of the newer ones because they do seem kind of this one fast. I'm really interested by this one. <laughs> I think I'm gonna watch this one. But there's a whole, there's so many good ones. Um, try to get Brandy to call Dina in my game. It had 100% forgotten she died. Oof. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Uh, The Grudge. Story, The Return. Horror. <laughs> this is, this is a fun title. So it's made in 2010. <laughs> you got good emotes. You got some emotes. Horror. Honestly, those emotes match the horror theme. <laughs> uh, the Grudge The Sims 2. Horror school kids going into the... I don't know how to say it. This house. Okay. I think the creator... Um, the English is a little broken. I think from what I remember, the description. Let's see. I'm curious, though. I gotta turn up the sound. Do I have to read? Hey guys, I have something to say. Okay, what's up? 
There is a house here in Japan. It's most haunted houses in whole Japan. <laughs> Not whole. <laughs> Hello, Danny. Welcome in. <laughs> yeah, I think the, the English is a little rough. <laughs> but why are all the top machinima suggestions so triggering? <laughs> whole. Yeah, right. I know, really. I may mean it. What, Lou? Oh god, look how crunchy. Hit the road. Why, wait, why is it just... Was there a fire? <laughs> yeah, I think the English makes it fun. <laughs> it's the original version of Grudge. Uh, so, okay, this is the haunted house. Yes, I know. I like to, yes, I like to go in, but I don't know. Is it safe? Oh, wait, this low-res boy is kind of horrifying. <laughs> this low-res boy. <laughs> they must, yeah, they deleted the road and then filled it with some sort of dirt. <laughs> He's so pale. Oh, it got really loud. Sure it is. Just a haunted house because it's scary outside. Okay. Oh, OMG, did you see that? What? <laughs> Somebody running by. I know your plan. You just make us scary, but I don't. <laughs> Shaky camera. Yeah, please. It's just an old house. Okay, Jason, go in then. <laughs> but I know more. There is a whole story. Wait, wait, okay. We're going too fast. We're like, what is happening? Am I? I'm not sped up still. Am I? No. <laughs> the low graphic setting hand, yeah. There was a whole story about the house. Yeah, right. Story. So, so what? Okay, I go in alone. I, I know. I love the low graphic setting too. Honestly, it's it's give. It's all like coming together. The, it's all the subtitles and the graphics are all just like coming together in a very fun way. <laughs> a whole story. And no, oh, oh, oh no, I accidentally muted it. I was trying to read. The reading is making me nervous. So, and no, I hope for you, M Muki, it's not true. Uh oh. Oh my gosh. I know, I know, not sure it's true, but I don't know. <laughs> Muki? Is it Muki? He a little chonky. Oh. Hello? Kayako girl. Who's spooky? Wait, who's spooky? <laughs> I think that's the girl. <laughs> who's spooky? <laughs> I love that. <laughs> I love it. Who's spooky? Oh, okay, okay, okay. What the hug? The way she tried to hug him, <laughs> that was kind of spooky. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Who's spooky? Me. No, I was. I was spooky. <laughs> I was spooky. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Who's spooky? It gets dark. I think we must go now. When Jason is back. Yeah, right. But he's ten minutes away from uh, use. Where is he? Okay, I go after him. You go. You two stay here, okay? Now, please, we stay out all together. Oh my god, she's screaming. It's my boyfriend. Go after him, okay? If you want or not, I don't care. Bye, see you. <laughs> there needs to be a new thing with the music. That's true. The, the, the lady. Listen to Miyuki, please. Maybe she's right. Now, please, Cho, don't go in that house. <laughs> this is the strangest sounding thing I've ever lurked through. <laughs> oh, that little kid is wild. <laughs> that little kid is ridiculous. Jason! Oh. 
Okay, I... <laughs> Wait, the tree coming through the... Bubby, you gotta stop this. She, we're having a stare down. She's she's digging holes in the bed again. <laughs> Jason! Jason! <laughs> the pale boy teleporting. I I think he's great. Jason! Jason! Oh, he's sitting up there. He's just sitting up there. Hey, how? Oh, hey, who are you? Oh, God. Uh, oh, boy. Hello, kid? Oh, it's you know what? It's that animation for the the military training item. That's what she's how she's crawling. I think that's how she's crawling. I think this the stink is the dirt for the crawling. It's the dirt. Watch the look okay, Yeah, she's that's why she's falling like that. <laughs> this is wild. I have no words. <laughs> Must it actually be hard to make these machines? Eat? No, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> they definitely put a lot of work into them. Where are they? It's 21 hours. What? They've been standing out front for 21 hours? Or are they saying that's like the time? <laughs> they've just been standing there. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, or are they saying like it's 21 hours, like the time? I think we must go check them, okay? <laughs> Nut what? <laughs> In Europe, some countries ask the time like that. Yeah, that's how, like, in the, here in the U.S., that's how they, we call military time, because, like, that's what the military says it. 21 hours or whatever. I think they're saying it's 9 p.m. Yeah, that's what I was wondering. <laughs> Made a few machinimers back in the day. Very time-consuming, yeah. Yeah, like 2,100 hours or whatever. Okay, you check the kitchen. I go upstairs. Those stairs always being see-through is wild. This child's just sitting here. Chew! Jace, Jay soon! Chew! <laughs> Wait, I need to look at that kid's face again. Hold on. Can I pause really? F oh, damn it. I want to see his face. <laughs> I need to analyze the textures. Yeah, look at him. Is that the mannequin skin at really low res? Is that what that is? Or is that a custom white skin? <laughs> look at him. He's cursed. It's, lo yeah, extremely low res. And alien eyes. Honestly, it's kind of a great look for, for like, these girlies with their, their low res hair and stuff. Like, it's kind of a fun, fun little look. This door must be the way to the place where Kayako was murdered. You? Oh boy, they actually look kind of creepy, little zombos. Sam Sims hair, yeah. <laughs> oh, I missed Machinima. Does the little boy meow like in the movie? That'd be funny. I haven't heard a meow yet. I haven't heard it meow. I just saw the screen. <laughs> yeah, the zombie noises are a lot. The way she just like walked for a minute. <laughs> this is a little spooky. Oh. Who? Who? Oh. Oh, there's the cat. That's the cat noise right there, right? He was in the the closet. I haven't watched that movie in a long, long time. I don't. I've only watched the American version though. I feel like I need to watch the original version. Yeah, he meows in the movie. He like makes like a creepy meow sound like in the closet or whatever. Me too. I used to go to my friend's house and use his internet to download all the hairs because I had dial up. That's funny. Oh no, she's dead. Now, now, now! <laughs> this is so good. Oh, there's the sound too. Oh, I hate that's a bad sound. <laughs> a bad sound. And, and, <laughs> made by Robin Bonsoon. <laughs> he becomes dead. <laughs> she is dead. 
Now she is. Now, now, now. Oops, I didn't mean to replay. That's great. That was that was a work of art. <laughs> that was a work of art. Does Robin Monsoon have anything else going on? White chicks scene? Final Destination 3 tanning scene? <laughs> Final Destination 4? Selena Gomez? <laughs> They've got a lot going on here. They got a lot of videos. Oh, looks like they got all kinds of stuff. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> the chipettes? <laughs> Put a little eye. That was fun. That was a fun little adventure. <laughs> yeah, and Sims 2, that's interesting. Yeah, that one's kind of, that'd be kind of wild. <laughs> okay, back to the beige depressing. Honestly, I like Jennifer's like, yeah, you can see her goofed up legs there when she moves. I like Jennifer's brown, all brown with like the all white with the touch of brown. It's pretty great. The creator seems Winko adjacent, possibly. Possibly. Also, the baby has this white outfit, too. I forgot about that. Honestly, this poor child. Let's see, what are you trying to do, John? Do you not go to sleep? Is he not able to sleep because of that? Yeah, okay. No, he can't sleep because of it. Damn it. Okay. We might have to come up with some alternative options. For, for a trash mommy. Did he learn to potty? Actually, I don't know. Not yet. He learned to talk, but he hasn't potty trained. Can you get in that way, or do I have to... No. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna have to make our, our, a shed out back. No. Okay, John. I like what a pitiful little little mess John is, honestly. Kind of great. Go to sleep. Oh, she almost as much trouble dead as alive. You're right. What am, I, am I hearing a screaming? What are you screaming about? Also, the death of Tiffany shows as a good memory in, for Jennifer. It's green. I love that. Whereas obviously it's gonna be, it's red for for John, and he remembers lost Tiffany to the Grim Reaper. That Reaper guy is one mean dude. I should have kicked the other hand, picked the other hand. And then she remembers it as good. It's funny. There we go. Yeah, I want to I want to set it up somewhere. Um, what's it say for the green? Oh, you're right. What's it say? Also, I, I gotta head out to work. Have a great rest of the stream. Maybe I'll be able to pop back later. Thank you for hanging out, Rosanna. Thank you, thank you. Have a good day at work. Or night. Um, life's so short. One moment you're here, the next you're gone. Really makes you think. I guess it's the same, probably. No, well, I guess, yeah, no, it's different. Because this one says, This sim was so important to me, I can't imagine how I'm going to go on. Only time can ease my pain. Yeah, she's like, hmm, well, whoops, she died. Tee hee. Like, that's kind of the vibe. <laughs> so she likes that she not. Yeah, that, that too, butt spot. That too, butt spot. <laughs> sure. Johnny, you gotta take, take care of everything. Johnny's falling apart. Johnny is falling apart. Oh, she said tee hee. <laughs> Should I... I'm tempted to get rid of this white picket fence all the way around. How do we feel about that? Like, it feels so restricted. I kind of like it out front, but maybe not everywhere? I don't know. Would that be an issue? Ugh, I hate this stupid wall too close to sim thing. Like, why does it matter? Like, what if I just put it all the way across the front? I also need to make it so it goes the right way. Okay, so it's like just the not close memory. As for the that are not close to, okay. I 
I gotta flip this around because it's facing the wrong way. Just kind of do that. I don't think that's terrible. I could also go all the way around. Um. So it's design and code and unclip into it. Yeah, I don't know. It's just annoying. But I can also just move them. Oh, the non-close one is red too, unless they're enemies, like in this case. Right, that would make sense. Like this. And then we can easily kind of expand the garden a little and stuff. We'll do this. And put some of these, like, inside of... And I might fix the dirt to be, like, my custom dirt. My custom dirt. Gotta get that custom dirt. Then we can build a little... A little shed. This can, like, connect over here. Oops, I forgot I bought this dumb thing. I might just delete it for now. We don't need it. Let's see. Oops, I was already... I'm gonna do this and make it... A little up. A little up. I feel like it should just be little. It's like a little shack. And a door, like some little old looking door. This is what their front door looks like, but they might... But it also looks like it would look good on this. On like a little shack. Or even... Yeah, I might... Mm, maybe we don't want it to be seen see-through. Maybe he wants it private. <laughs> I guess this could technically work too, if I recolor it. I kind of like the, the middle door. I might just do this one for now. Let me see what kind of walls I put on it. I'll go from there. <laughs> Mid door. You like the, the middle door? Or are you calling my door mid? <laughs> are you calling my door mid? I was gonna use this. The like a little happy little red shack. Maybe. I wish I hmm. Thank you very much for the follow, Sims Girly. <laughs> it's up for interpretation, okay. I kind of like this. Uh, what does it mean if something is mid? I think it means like, yeah, like it's it's not great. Like it's not bad, but it's not great. Like it's middle of the road. That's how I interpret it. Do this. I like this better. Average, yeah. My mother has a word that she says that is not a real word, but she insists with every every bit of her being that it's a real word. And every time she says it, she she has to like defend herself. And the word is mediocre. She thinks she's saying mediocre. And I tell her mediocre is what you're trying to say. And she says, no, that's a different word. It's mediocre. <laughs> She'll say it for like a temperature. <laughs> like the, the, the water is mediocre. <laughs> like it means like like, moderate temperature. <laughs> and I'm like, that's not a word. It's not a word. Is she from Jersey? She's not. She is from Mass. So, like, maybe that's it. What color door? Did you just do, like, a little white door? I like the texture of that door better. <laughs> Old people things, yeah. <laughs> Mediocre temperature. <laughs> I just thought it was just mediocre with a say. That's what you would think. That's what you would think. I, and I feel like when I was younger, I would say, like, mediocre. She goes, no. It's not mediocre. That's different. <laughs> it's mediocre. She will specifically say the ah. <laughs> Me windows. She, does she... Wait, what does she think the other ones mean? It's like, I don't know. I think she thinks they're kind of all mean the same thing. Because, like, what is it? There's mediocre, 
and then there's moderate but like she always uses it specifically for temperature and i'm like you don't really say mediocre for the temperature of something you know <laughs> leviosa <laughs> leviosa <laughs> like she she she'll um i think that's like i don't know it's like her word for it's using mediocre but for like the temperature of something if that makes sense I guess I'll just do like, I was trying to figure out what kind of color I want inside here. Like it doesn't make sense, but it kind of does. But it doesn't. <laughs> My mom uses the term hard on as synonymous with grudge. Like Jane has a hard on for Aunt Beth. <laughs> My mom, you know what's funny? My mom says that for fetish. She uses the word fetish in that sort of way. <laughs> That's not the word. That's not the word. <laughs> That's not it. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> she's like, like she it's like a like an like a like you said, like grudge or like a dark obsession. Like a bad like these people can't get over this like you said, like a grudge type thing. Like she got a fetish for her. <laughs> like, no, mom. <laughs> He's got a fetish for that. No. <laughs> no. I feel like I just want like a worn wood inside. That's not it. <laughs> it's like that's not the word. <laughs> Maybe like that. Hmm. I don't love this one either. <laughs> That's the true enemies to lovers. Yeah, maybe just like a more plain wood paneling. I was thinking that. I don't... That's like... Oh, maybe that. That kind of matches the door and stuff. Oh, no. <laughs> a box club. Wait, what is it with all the moms using the words wrong like this? Or using them in this way? <laughs> But also, like, that one I can I can see in a way working, but... <laughs> when my mom says stuff like that, I always say, that's a brave phrase to use when you don't know what it means. That's a really fun way to say it. <laughs> that's a really fun way to say it. <laughs> oh, no. Hmm. I don't really want it to be too matchy-matchy, but at this point, I think I gotta commit. You know? Ooh, I don't know if I like that. I think I might need a different wall. A darker wall? The darker color is a little more bearable. We will have windows, but I feel like they'll be blocked. Yeah, it's like, it's technically correct. I feel like that word I hear like really religious people say using that that what you're what you said fox for like i feel like i've seen like here at least like religious people would use that word because for them that word is just always bad you know what i mean <laughs> i'm gonna go for a bit watching something with my friend okay have fun danny <laughs> are you a danger where you're redeeming an olive oil to cleanse are we cleansing i wish i had a, like a white recolor of this one I think that happens when they got old because I can remember th they didn't do that way back when I was young. Yeah, that's weird. I don't... I don't know. It's cleansing. Purification. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Like... My... You know... I don't know if it's just... The education, the way it was back in the 70s. Like, my mom just has a regular high school education. doesn't have, like, a diplo anything beyond that. And she's one of the only of her eight siblings that got a, a high school diploma. But, like, you know what I mean? I don't know if it's just... I don't know. We need to use the bird decals more. Once in public... Called, once in public called the Kardashian show a master... Conservatory cesspool of entitled girls in future. Oh no. We were on the bus. Oof. That's pain. <laughs> That's wild. 
I'm trying to find this window. Here it is. This is the window I was looking for, but of course it's going to end up being like not the right. It doesn't really center. I technically could make this one bigger, but I'm not going to. We're just going to use this. <laughs> this is an old pe <laughs> That is such an old person thing. I'm sorry. Eight sibs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's got a bunch of siblings. And her father had 13 siblings. Or he was one of 13. Yeah. I can't imagine. Maybe I'll give her this. Yeah. <laughs> Poor woman. Yeah, exactly. Well, that's like my mom's mom. She she had was the one that had like eight, nine kids. And one, one ended up like dying in, in infancy. So... But, like, she just was constantly pregnant. Like, every couple of years. Every one of the kids is almost exactly two years apart. Like, she was obsessed with always having a baby every two years. It's kind of weird. <laughs> it's not one mother, I guess. Yeah, it's uh, this one. This was, I think, all one mother. Both. I don't know with, like, my, my grandfather's family where it was 13. Yeah, or at least the birth control didn't exist. Um, you know, or was shamed, or, I mean, you know. <laughs> For the modern. <laughs> I'm just sitting here doing nothing. Okay, what what is my, what's Mima gonna have? There was, yeah, there was no. Yeah. <laughs> the pin. <laughs> What do we, I feel like he's gonna decorate. What if he steals things from the house? She's gotta get a chair. He's like, this was her favorite chair. J Jenny just comes down and finds a bunch of furniture missing from the house. This 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 was, or this was her favorite rug. <laughs> Good bid. I wrote a twenty six page paper. On the history of criminalized abortion and contraception was was deemed obscene. Yeah, that's wild. But I mean, it's still something people people do. People say is you know. She's in the chair. <laughs> She's in the chair. Um, maybe a, one of these butterflies hanging up above. <laughs> We're just decorating the room. Maybe like this. Mm, I don't know if I like that. Um, my nan, on the other hand, is very simple. Anything on TV is an opera or Mickey Mouse. <laughs> Anything in a pan is a pie. <laughs> well, that's funny. So everything on TV is either opera or Mickey Mouse. That's funny. All citrus or mandarin or lemon. Okay. I'll reject the possibility of having 10 plus kids and play 100 baby challenges of the Sims. Exactly. Yeah. I don't know what else to grab from down here or kind of copy. Maybe, maybe actually I should have stolen this. Maybe I should use one of the wallpapers from in the house in here. I'm just thinking about how next round I'm going to come here to play this this household and I'm going to forget and then I'm going to look out back and go, oh, there's a shed out here. And then I'm going to see Mima in the trash can in the shed, you know? <laughs> I don't know what else to... I think that's probably good. Maybe this little shelf of stuff somewhere. 
she got her little shelf of things. <laughs> and then, oh, you hear the honks. <laughs> you hear small honks. Mr. Hank's honks. He's honking outside. He's honking at someone. I think I put, oh, I was gonna put a bunch of flowers. Like he's leaving her offerings of flowers. Oh, it keeps snapping up there. No, I don't want it there. <laughs> so creepy. They won't be. Yeah, I think I'm gonna lock this door completely. I think that's what I'll do. So we'll just we'll just say he goes in, but like he doesn't actually. Ugh, I wish it wouldn't snap, but maybe I need to just put one there so it, the snapping stops. It might still continue, but no, oh, god damn it, it's still continuing. Let me just throw this out here right now. I was trying to do it the easy way. Oh god, that's huge. I <laughs> love Spectre vibes. That's probably enough. That's probably enough. <clears throat> I'll turn snapping back on. <laughs> Offers up first point to Bradley. Bradley's just locked in the room. <laughs> the only thing is I don't have a light. Maybe we need like a candle. What kind of, like, candle options do I have? Oh, a candle up here. That seems dangerous. <laughs> that seems very dangerous. Oops, did I just... I think I accidentally dropped it in. Like, it's... <laughs> that makes me afraid. <laughs> Must lock the door so John will, will be the only one who can enter the room. Yeah. In reality, I think I need to... Oh, I know what I can do. Wait, we'll do this. Um, what kind of candle? I'm trying to think of a way I can do this. I guess I'll just do this one. Does this just go... Oh, it goes all the way across. I imagine it's a fake Ikea candle, maybe. I've never been to an Ikea. There's not any around here. I hear talk of the Ikea, the great Ikea, but I've never seen one in, in IRL. What if he, like, what if we have, like, a little fence? Can't intersect objects. What are we intersecting? All the things? Okay. We're gonna just, we're just gonna lock the door. Oop, I have the dog selected. No. It's cursed. Lock. Um, we're just gonna lock for all sims. Oh, we also didn't put a roof on it. Meemaw's gonna be cold without a roof. Meemaw's gonna be cold. There we go. Yeah, I always think it's weird people, like, you buy food there. It's very fun to explore. They have meatballs and cranberry sauce. Like, I don't know that I'd want to buy meatballs at an Ikea. That's so weird to me. When a decade ago, the first branch opened in my country. My family go there occasionally. Interesting. God, look at this room. Oh, no. This trash can on Rekiner looks like an image that would be tagged as hashtag me or hashtag... <laughs> g -poy? <laughs> on, on mid-2010 Tumblr, yeah. <laughs> Damn, buy the meatballs. They're so good. Yeah, I mean, I believe it. I like a good, like, meatballs can be a really yummy meal. Yes, yes, buy the Swedish meatball, we say. <laughs> so we don't go... I just think of, like, messy meatballs and, like, fancy furniture, or, like, maybe not fancy, but, like, good furniture. Like, that makes me nervous. You know? Like, <laughs> I don't know. Field trip. <laughs> nice. They're slightly overrated, but good when you've spent all day on your feet looking at furniture. Okay. Yeah, we'll save. 
Okay, there's like a, a canteen, like a cafeteria. I just feel like feral children are going to be running around with their meatballs. <laughs> you know, like I'm expecting the feral children to just be running loose with their meatballs. <laughs> spilling them on all the furniture. <laughs> meatball hands, exactly like nasty children with meatball all over their face, like sauce all over their face. Yeah, it's just they're just running around with their meatballs. We have a knock-up. The point is just to get people in the store. So there's decor, furniture, bedding, and then you can get a snack. Yeah. I really like the umbrellas from Ikea. They're super good, or used to be at least. Okay. See, it makes me want to go to an Ikea. I've never been to one. There's not like anywhere around here that's just like a nice little furniture place. Also, I should move this. Now that we've got more space here, I think I should move him. Maybe like here. I feel bad leaving his food out. Maybe I will put it back over here. One thing we were talking about the the way the when they refill the dog bowls, it gets sometimes gets spun against the wall and they can't get to it. That's one thing I really like about this one, which is this is converted from the pet stories. This one they don't it lasts a long time and it doesn't get spun. It just stays right where it's supposed to be. So I really like this one. I think if you were to look up any, like, Sim Sims Pet Stories conversions, it's probably in the pack with it. Um, I bought the pillow from Ikea. It's so good. It supports my head, like, really great. Okay. They're normally seclude secluded and not in normal places, like normally next to an airport or in the middle of industrial areas. Okay. Hmm. I'll have to, like, look it up. I wonder if I typed in, I just see how many, like, how many miles away is the nearest Ikea. I probably, there's probably one nearby that I don't even realize. Oh, Montreal. <laughs> Do I want to take a trip to Montreal? <laughs> I go up to French Canada. Canada. <laughs> I don't know. I gotta go to Quebec. Go see Ikea. <laughs> take a trip to Quebec for Ikea. <laughs> Canadia. <laughs> I have to cross the border. <laughs> French Canadia. -adia? Yes, the Canadian conversion works in our favor. Go to the Ontario one. Okay. Ours isn't just some res area. The nearest business exclusively sells tile. That's funny. Okay, Jenny's obsessed with this paper airplane. Oh, never mind. She's throwing it away. Okay. Um, recycle. Also, it's Wednesday, so this is the last day for this household. Next, we get to check out the Broke family. So we'll get to play them a little bit today. God, every time I, I pan to the room, I'm just like... Maybe we should have them try for baby before we're done. So that we have a, a nice... Uh, next step for next time. The room is just overexposed. It really is. Like, nice and warm. This. This. It is very overexposed. Oh, you know what? It's because I have this light off. I mean, on. Auto lights, all lights. There we go. Because it's daytime and I had those lights, like, forcibly on. So, like, that's a little bit better. I just... Can I do auto... I did auto lights, all lights, I guess. Look at this depressed baby. This baby does not know what imagination is. <laughs> and that's exclusively because the furniture doesn't sell any bathroom tile. Oh, okay. The only real thing that doesn't come with the house. That's funny. What's he doing? He's just sitting there. Someone saved Bradley. I'm not paused. The game's not paused. He's blinking. <laughs> He's become personalityless. <laughs> Here are the flies. Look at his little freckles, though. He's got nice little, like, freckles on his face. Where's the flies? Where are the flies? Go on an adventure to find the flies? 
Are they in here? Oh. They're here. Bradley, why don't you play? Play with toys. He can walk, so when once the babies can walk, they're allowed to play with toys from the toy box. There we go. She just cleaned that up. Um... Is autonomy off? I don't think so. No, it's on. I think he, you know what I think was happening is he was like trying to do something, but he couldn't get to it. I think he was trying to follow his mom, but he couldn't get there. Yeah, maybe she should potty train him. Oh, we gotta empty it. So I think he was actually spamming a thing, but he couldn't actually get through the door because I have the special toddler door. Oh, now he's hungry. He's hungry. So yeah, he's kind of just... Okay, I probably should have like a, a chair for him. But we're just going to give him a bottle and then maybe we can potty train after. Hopefully I'll remember. <laughs> the baby is miserable. <laughs> this baby is miserable. Oh god, look at Grandma Stank. <laughs> is Grandma Stank? I need a picture of Grandma Stank. Ooh. Look to you! <laughs> Ooh. I said up to you! <laughs> Why is the trash stanky? Grandma's in there! <laughs> <laughs> also, it's very old. I think it's just very old trash. Oh god, look at our garden! It's so bad! He, I think John's depressed after his mommy died. Look at his garden. His garden is falling apart. Yeah, I think it stinks sometimes when it's like very... Is it is it because of the ashes that it would stink? I don't know. Or is it just because it gets full? Because it is weird. I don't see it stank too much. Did you feed the baby? Yeah. Okay, she's taken... She's... Oh, no, she... No, yeah, she did. That's her. Um... I'll have her potty train the baby. Hmm. I feel like I want to fill... this in with dirt a little bit more. Like, it just looks open. I guess that technically works. The other thing that I can do is put these to the side. I just kind of like them looking like they were part of the garden. I can use this. And then with move objects, I can plop these back on top. That lets me put it on top and they all kind of match. Do that over here too if I wanted to. Maybe I'll put more of the sunflowers. Neighbors told police they smelled something awful and they, they, they seem like such a nice family. Yeah. There you go. That works. I don't feel like cleaning this one up, but this one also could use it. The white picket fence, yeah. Jumana says it's quite incriminating to keep human remains in the trash. <laughs> you know. Funny to chat. You know. <laughs> you know. Hello, Jean. You like this? I love. I love sunflowers. They're my favorite flower. That and like any kind of like daisy. Funny to chat. Uh, also need to spray many. Johnny boy, you gotta get to walk. Oh, she's potty training. Gosh, I gotta roll ads again? It feels like I just barely rolled them. Poops and rows. Those are nice. I haven't had, like, seen, like, a nice, grown, like, a nice tulip in a while. 
Poppies are fun, okay. She's kind of tired. I'm gonna give her a little energy. I'll just have her serve some lunch. Actually, she's gonna clean up all these plates. <clears throat> and then save lunch. Save lunch. Wildflowers are fun. I do like wildflowers. Who's this? Zane Fricker. His name's Zane Fricker. We hit pay all bills. Actually, what is it? How about John makes food? What are you making, John? Stuff face. No, John, I need you to get yourself together here. Serve some grilled cheese. John's gotta get himself together. Also, I don't think he finished doing all his stuff. John, I just, I feel like John is falling apart. Without his mommy around, without mommy dearest around, he's, he's struggling. Like, he's struggling hardcore. His garden's failing. He's he's not even making he's not taking care of the house. Why didn't all the plates get clean up? You know what? I'm gonna be a cheater and do this. Oh damn it, it's not gonna let me. <laughs> damn it. There we go. I'll clean those up after. Sure, I could force error. I remember doing that as a kid all the time, force error deleting the, the plates. <laughs> I'm gonna do Black Widow challenge on Sims today, but the woman didn't stay alive, so it failed! Oh no! <laughs> funny. How did she die? Out of curiosity. By hunger! Oh no! I don't have any specific one flower like most. Is that weird? I don't think so. I think some people probably just don't care about the flowers as much or anything. But yeah, I like I like anything that looks like daisies or sunflowers or anything like that. There we go. Go and play some soccer. Oh, or not. She's crying. What's she crying about? Maybe the bugs? Who's that? Kaylin Goss. Why is John always eating out here? Do you think that their marriage is struggling? <laughs> He's out here eating out here instead of in with her. Yeah, I don't- I wish they wouldn't care about the bugs so much. Like, why do we need a memory about the damn roaches? It just seems like a little extra. Like, like in the base game, when there wasn't as much going on, like, I get it, I guess? But I wish that they would just calm down a little. Also, I think the baby might have learned. Did the baby learn? Yeah, the baby was potty trained, so that's good. Now he'll be able to stay up here in his beige paradise. <laughs> And go potty whenever he wants. And go to the, go to sleep whenever he wants. He's pretty much a hands-off toddler. What is the term for, like, parents that purposely, like, are very hands-off with their kids and, like, make them do everything and just, like, go running off into the world, <laughs> like, at young ages? I forget what it's called. Um, I've been semi-traumatized by certain things like lice or mold. But still, crying about it is too much, yeah. Bad parent, neglect, yeah, I know, absent, but there's like a term. There's like a specific term. Like, um, unschooling, maybe? There's like... I don't know what it is. Uh, like, free-range parenting or something. Permissive parents. There's something like that. My grandma always said she didn't like getting flowers because it's a waste. And they always just die. Yeah, I get that. Yeah, like free range parenting. Like it's it's literally like a whole like it's kinda like the granola mom version of like I don't know how to even I don't know. It's weird. Put in crib. I need you to just take care of your plants. Is the the fences affecting the kids aren't chickens, yeah? It's free range is right. It just sounds dumb because it is. Yeah. Okay. So that's like it's yeah the opposite of helicopter parent. It's like a whole thing. It's really questionable. <laughs> Thank you much for the raid. This sounds really loud. Why is my alert so loud? Empress Taga. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome in. We were playing Stardew Valley. Perfect. 
<laughs> this is we're also playing Stardew Valley with John Burb. <laughs> this is John Burb Stardew Valley. <laughs> I haven't played Stardew, actual Stardew Valley in a long time. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. Welcome in. <laughs> to be honest, it's legit. It's Stardew. <laughs> John Burb is, is Stardew and Animal Crossing all in one. Typical 80s, 90s mom don't, did not, did, don't care so much. Yeah. Weren't so afraid they're kids. Yeah. Yeah. Long leg all -wiv. You got long leg all -wiv. All of us a question. Yeah. <laughs> when is dinner time? That's her question, is when is dinner time? I, I did have mods with me, but I think they are deep into Lurkville. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Love the right too. Thank you. <laughs> it's some Sims, Sims music. Uh, tend. Okay, he's tending. It seems like it's working. I feel like we need lights out here. Um, I've been addicted to Stardew the first time these last couple of weeks, and I can't leave. I don't care about any other game anymore. It's so addictive. I, I hope it wears off. That's funny. I was like that the last few days with Animal Crossing. My, my, I've re, uh, I've reawoken my Animal Crossing obsession, but it's probably going to die pretty soon. Like it, it, it always just like, is like a week or two, and then I forget about it for months. My cat too. She will scrim if she doesn't hear the wet, her wet food. That's funny. Okay, buddy. I think you finally took care of everybody. Can we water many? Instead of, you don't have to use that bathroom that bad. I had that a few weeks ago. Same, um, it is like super addiction for two days, then burnout. Six months almost since I last played Sims. Oh my goodness. I, I play Sims so much that I don't even think about it anymore. <laughs> it's just like a constant. <laughs> is it constant? Sending hugs to uh, to us, struggling cat mom's dead parents. It's funny. You realize you can do the same thing on The Sims as an Animal Crossing in five minutes instead of two months. True. <laughs> True. Very much needed in these trying times. A bonus honk. A bonus honk. Never really played Sims too much. Yeah, it's definitely can be a little niche, but I think it's very worth it. It's a very fun game. It's, it's in my opinion, it's probably the most accurate of all, like it's the most functioning simulation side of things. Um, yeah. A new kitten stares up at her food on the shelf and starts screaming bloody murder over and over again. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, Hank, Olive will fuss if she decides it's time to eat. Um, Hank does too. Hank just bellows, because of course he doesn't really, he can't bark. Hank does not have the ability to bark. He can only bay, because he's a hound. So he just like, sounds like an air horn going off. That's, he has, he, it's either zero or air horn. He doesn't have anything in between. <laughs> also, my brother told me that Hank fell down the stairs yesterday night. At some, at some point when he had him at his house, he said he heard him coming up the stairs and then all of a sudden he heard a bang, a bunch of banging, and he realized he got up and it was Hank falling down the entire flight of stairs. <laughs> Which is very Hank coded. <laughs> like, how do you do that, Hank? He seems okay. He seems fine. He was, he's his normal self today. But it's like, Hank, how did you do that? <laughs> yeah, he's doing okay. He got slippery paws. When you said no bark, I think of that dog in Grown Ups too. Oh, <laughs> sounds like a turkey. Oh, yeah, poor little Hanky. He's okay though. He's not. He's he's fine. Okay, it's gonna be time for us to finish this household soon. I think we should have Jennifer and and John try for baby. I'm gonna have you chill out. I'm gonna have you stop and come and relax. Just a dog doing dog things, like falling down the stairs. He just clumby, 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 clumsy. <laughs> he is just a little clumby. That man re leaped down our attic steps once, and now he's not allowed up there anymore. Oh, boy. <laughs> we've, we've had this conversation before. I love I love Rat Man because it's very ominous who Rat Man is. <laughs> 
And so she actually thinks she's dying if she gets hungry and there's no food in her bowl. But like, I could see that with a kitten, you know, cats, a little baby kitten doesn't understand like its own body and it just feels hunger. I'm dying. Feed me. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> I could see that. <laughs> but Olive's, Olive's usually a little bit more polite. Look at him. He always stops and goes, my wife's hot in the middle of everything he's doing. <laughs> everything he's doing. Anytime she's near him. Her nut sister's nut. Wait, I actually... No, I swear she actually thinks she's dying. She gets nut gray. Not nut gray. Not nut gray. <laughs> Understandable. I mean, we stand there for John. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Baby time. Gretman is my 16 year old mini poodle. His government name, I love it. His government name is Brownie. But my husband and I call him Ratman because he exudes rat energy. <laughs> oh. The real music played after. She, it is. It is. <laughs> you almost got me. I think that one's a little too loud. I need to like turn it down a little so it's more believable. The game one is like a little bit quieter. Does the name Ned Fulmer mean anything to you? Do not stand wife guys in my household. <laughs> oh. Um, was that the game or a Twitch channel? Both. <laughs> it was actually both. One was the Twitch and then slit right after was the game. <laughs> it's confusing. They got me the first time because I was looking away. And then I had a double take when the true sound happens. Dun, dun, dun. He's a good boy. Also, that alert was good timing. <laughs> John would uh, find those boomer anti-wife jokes and be abhorrent. Oh. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, it's about to be Thursday. We're going to save... That was a quite a, I did not I was expecting the burbs to be like the ex, like what the burbs usually are. Remember the try guys and he was a super wife guy and then he ended up cheating. Oh, I think that sounds familiar. This sounds familiar. Um Oh, it was almost perfect timing, yeah. Uh so yeah, so we're gonna we're done with this household. I was expecting less chaos. Also, I, for some reason, when I read Robin's message, I, I thought we were talking about the Ned guy, not J our John, <laughs> our John. Yeah, he would be he would find the anti wife jokes and be just like disgusted by them. Um, yeah, let me save again. Th this was fun. We're gonna go to the next household. So what, the burbs weren't burbing. They really weren't. The burbs were chaos. The burbs. Yikes. He is still with his wife and they had another child last I checked. Huh. Well, you know what? I, <laughs> the burbs are pleasant. You're right. Wait, but that's so right. They're pleasanting because like, and they literally took, he took the pleasant name and the pleasant curse. <laughs> and the pleasant curse. Jennifer's tribe complete. Minus mom and law plus baby. Yep. Okay. We're going to play the next household, which the next household I have on my list is the Broke family. So I'm excited about these guys. These guys are a favorite of mine in Pleasant View usually. But obviously, since we're in early Pleasant View, the family is like a step back from its normal self. So I'm excited about this. Of course, we have the icon, Miss Brandy Broke. We have Skip Broke. And we have Dustin Broke as a child. So Skip is alive. Dustin's a babe, a child. Brandy's here. Time to kill husband. <laughs> Brandy and Skip struggle to get their life together. It's not easy not having a steady income. But at the end of the day, they're happy and healthy. At least sometimes. Brandy is getting... Some strange nausea recently. Wonder what that could be. <laughs> there we go. I, gotta, I was going to say, I'm going to kill Skip. I kind of don't want to. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how things go.
I hope we I, I don't know. We'll see if things we'll see how things unfold. Oh not him starting next to the pool. Wait. <laughs> the game said, um Okay. Um so Skip is I like their trailer, the way that their trailer's been done over. This is really nice. Well, at least there's a ladder. Will Skip be given the swiper trait? Yeah, I think we got it. We got to go through, give everybody their traits, read their bios, all of that. I'm going to make it Saturday because that's the day we've been starting on. She deserves to be happy. <laughs> Look at that. Who's here? Calvin Marriott is here? What's up? What is this? This is the queen. Oh, that's not the queen. Miss Brandy, the queen here. I might adjust some of her makeup, but maybe that's also like her her look. Yeah, Skip was a criminal. Um, look at this house. This is very nice. I like their their room with the lights and a little baby Dustin. Look at little baby Dustin. Um, so Brandy wants to have a baby. She's a family sim. Lifetime wish is to graduate three kids from college. What is you? He's a popularity sim. He wants to be ho become a Hall of Famer. We might also adjust some of their lifetime wishes. Obviously, he doesn't have any. Ooh, he wants to tell a joke to Angela. He wants to meet Angela or chill out with Angela. Yeah, the the Brokes are great. I I am a big fan of the Brokes. So let's see what's Skip got for a bio. Let's go visit Mr. Skip here. Mr. Mr. Skip is chilling. It was so hard to leave his family behind in Riverview, but he knows it was for the better. Here in Pleasant View, there are more opportunities for professional swimmers. Oh. Wait, so his thing is that he supposedly is a professional squ swimmer. Yeah, he's super fit. I didn't realize that that's how they're spinning it. I didn't realize that that was the spin we're getting. Okay. I can't remember where I saw it, so I could be wrong. Oh, oh, we're talking about the other thing. <laughs> Professional squimmer? Interesting. He's kind of grouchy and serious. But he's very outgoing and active. And not, like, super sloppy. Does he have, like, any really strong interests? Not really. His hobby is music and dance. I'm surprised it's not fitness. Maybe it could be fitness. Mystery sim, learn to talk. Yeah, we he moved out, moved in, grew up. Interesting. So he moved in, moved out, moved in, grew up, then had a kiss with Brandy, fell in love with Brandy, moved out, moved in, made out, um, had a first woohoo, and then they got married and stuff. They had dust in, pretty basic stuff. Oh, from YouTube comments. When you get to oh yes, um, I remember I remember seeing that. When you get to to Brandy, I would like to tell you there is a sim called Joe T. Neeby. He maybe named something else as a townie, but he is brother of Brandy. He'll be visiting when you load the broke lot. Okay, I I do um I did remember I do thank you for reminding me. I forgot about that. So he's so he's supposed to be. Is it newbie, not nebby? Wouldn't it be newbie? So he's supposed to be newbie? Joe newbie? Is that what he's supposed to be? Does it, they're showing us brothers here? Brother or sister? Yeah. Okay, so it makes sense it's newbie because, yeah, Bob and, Bob and Betty are their parents. So I'll have to, um, I can have her change his name. Calvin Marriott. Calvin Marriott. All right, but we're going to just keep reading some bios here. So that's his thing. He does, does he have he doesn't have a job right now. It also it doesn't look like he ever got employed in he's never had a job. Which is interesting. So he's never gotten into like criminal stuff yet. Traditionally Skip is like in the criminal career. Like the his actual like memories are that in like the regular Pleasant View is that he was like he was in the criminal career and then he got fired and then he died and there's like speculation about because he was also made enemies with another local criminal who is like the the default burglar in Pleasant View and then there was like maybe things yeah Gordon um and 
there was like speculation that he could have been actually killed by Gordon for because he left the criminal career, but he like knew too much or so, there was an argument between them or something like that. But maybe this skip is different, you know? So is that what him having becoming Hall of Famer is actually him joining the, the athletic career as a swimmer? Is that like maybe his thing? There was a Coca-Cola branded items, fridge pinball machine t-shirts from the Finland. Yeah, I have, I have those. I have some of them. I have, I can't grab it right now. These one. Coca-Cola fridge. <laughs> I don't ever use them. They're kind of stupid. Do I have the pinball machine? Yeah, I have the pinball machine. <laughs> That's weird. It is. It looks very strange. What's it called? Coca-Cola pinball. Rise of the decarbonator. Okay. Anyway, so that's that one. And then we've got Ms. Brandy. Queen Brandy. Um, okay, she never went to college. She has the memory of never going to college. Decarbonator. Uh, moved out. Calvin grew up, so she does she does remember her brother Calvin or Calvin. Not Calvin, but uh it's Joe. Then we have fell in love with Skip. She oh she got a job as a she, as at the culinary career. Got a promotion, had Dustin, Bob and Betty died. Body trained Dustin, grew up, and then all these I think are more recent ones. Uh what's her bio? Brandy's bio. No doubt, everyone considers Brandy the nicest sim in town. Although her simple kind of life, she wishes someday to design her own fancy clothing line. Okay, so she wants to, like, be a fashionista. But right now she works in the, in the culinary as drive through clerk. Okay. Interesting. She has a big interest in fashion and stuff. So she could, like, sell clothes or something one day. Then little baby Dustin. Little baby Dustin. He's in public school. He's got a C minus. What's your what's your bio, buddy? Dustin can't help himself. He ends up in trouble wherever he goes. But luckily, his cool dad always comes up comes in to help clean up the shenanigans. <laughs> okay, very wholesome. Very wholesome. Okay, let me just hit play and let them establish. Let's go, Joe. So it was Joe T. Joe T. Newby? What is the T supposed to be? I'm out of curiosity. Joe T. Newby. Is that a, what is it a reference to? I'm curious. Wait, skipping Gordon's lover arc? Tickles, not tickles. <laughs> not tickles. Okay. Well, let them kind of. Oh, he's got to go to school. Um, Dance together. Let's see. So we got to pick out some traits. What I think I'm going to do is we're going to use the randomizer. Hi, Delirium. How are you doing? Um, let's go here. We are playing some um, early Pleasant View. Technically, it's early Strange View because this Pleasant View is a subhood on my early Strange Town. So we call it Strange View. But we're in early Pleasant View right now. So it's Pleasant View, but based like like a decade into the past of when the normal Pleasant View starts up. Um, and we're just barely starting playing the Broke household for the first time, so I'm assigning them some traits and stuff. Add missing traits. Oh, I didn't mean to add them to Joe, but you know what? Why not? They're like going to woohoo. Right now I need you to stop. Oh my god. Okay, the chaos? Okay, she's going to throw up. He's hacking. They're all sick. Everybody here is sick. Buddy, Skip is sick with the flu. You don't say. You don't say. I'm not doing well today. I'm so glad you're streaming right now. I'm sorry that you're not doing well. Yeah, I'm glad you're able to stop by. What did he get? Brooding, irresistible, no sense of humor, coward, and dramatic. Interesting. I don't know... I don't know what he, because cause the way that they've got him set up a little bit differently, I don't know how I want to, to what kind of traits I want to give him. Like, we talked about giving him the swiper trait back, 
but is that should he have it anyway like it's his dark secret that he's actually good at stealing stuff or is he gonna go a different route like kind of kind of like travel and fashion what are his like skills he has skills in body and creativity his besties with bella he's friends with michael he doesn't know any any Gordon or anything. He hates Daniel. I don't know why him and Daniel... I don't know what happened with him and Daniel. Hmm. I'm torn. I don't know where to take it with him. So, like, he's... He's pretty outgoing, so I'm guessing that's where they got irresistible, but I don't know about, like, dramatic... Sometimes I like to do the, the randomizer or the missing traits thing to just start from somewhere. I don't know about brooding. No sense of humor I could see because of the fact that he is so grouchy and serious. <laughs> Maybe Skip is the greaser and Daniel is the jock. You're true. That, that might be it. <laughs> that might be it. Let's see. I'm struggling to know where to start with him. Maybe athletic because of this whole swimming thing. Um, maybe he loves the heat or something. Yeah, Swiper automatically gives them the pickpocket ability. They don't do it autonomously, but it could be like some sort of dark secret of his that he's good at doing that, even though he wants to get into sports stuff. I don't know. Uh, Rebellious, maybe. rebellious could work i like that like he does he can't hold down a nine to five <laughs> maybe that's where he's he's learned being a swiper oh you wish that going to my comments and seeing the things missing i wish it wasn't autonomous oh okay autonomous whatever or autonomous or <laughs> oh thank you for deleting it but spot <laughs> i mean no, not but spot thank you for deleting but spot message comey I didn't even see it. Um, I forget that it's autonomous for them to like. To to it was just it, but spot was just like repeating a message that was more of a nice message that it didn't need to make fun fun of. <laughs> Wait, you finally figured it out? It's me. Oh, it's me, but spot. <laughs> Kobe's butt spot. Well, you you have an orange color, and butt spot has kind of an orange color. It's like a different orange. <laughs> Maybe that's it. Maybe that's the truth. Hmm. I'll do this. I guess we could try that. Is he uh, does coward and I feel like no sense of humor. I guess kind of works technically. And coward. I don't know. That's kind of an interesting spin for him. The real butt spot is the messages we sent along the way. <laughs> Wait, does butt spot choose which message to make fun of? I thought it was... It is random. It's random, yeah. But sometimes it's just, like, inappropriate. Like, I mean, they're, they're always inappropriate, but, like, some are funny inappropriate and some are just, like, unnecessary. <laughs> it's just random, though. Olive is a squirmy girl. Olive is a squirmy girl. I think I'm just going to go with these traits for him. What did Brandy get? Brandy got inappropriate, flirty, irresistible, loser, and loves the cold. I kind of like her getting... I like. I kind of like loser for her. I know that seems mean, <laughs> but I think I might get rid of inappropriate and loves the cold. I kind of feel like maybe... <laughs> I like loser for her because she's like not she's not been successful with some of her things sometimes butt spot picks favorites of the day yes yeah it like latch it just seems I don't know what it is about the pace of butt spot for some reason she's socially unaware despite trying to be a social climber true maybe what if what if I did socially awkward what is her where is she at with like her outgoingness She's not super outgoing. Maybe I could do socially awkward. I don't know how I feel about irresistible. 
or or flirty i feel like she needs one or the other but not both family oriented is good family oriented is really good for her or nurturing sometimes i either do family oriented or nurturing because it's kind of like i feel like they're sort of they kind of work kind of swap between one or the other maybe not irresistible i could do either that add this one and then we need one more Hopeless Romantic's good. Actually, that's a really good one. Um, or but also somebody said creative. I could also do like a creative one too. She could be artistic if she's into like fashion. Where is what was I looking for again? Hopeless Romantic. There it is. Did I swap something else for <sighs> artistic? I don't know. Mooch? Interesting. We could do Mooch. Although, I will say, she's the one that has a job. She's the one with a job. Not Skip. Skip doesn't have a job, but she does. <laughs> hmm. Skip should be the Mooch. Maybe Skip... What if instead of Swiper, we gave Sw Skip Mooch? That's kind of interesting. Or maybe swapped something out for... Because I like that idea... Or one of them. I feel like I could see Skip doing that. So should I g just give Brandy this so she has flirty, loser, socially awkward. I feel like flirty and socially awkward don't match. Like she just could have creative or, or artistic. I don't know if there's any other like artsy ones. I mean, I know there's like avant-garde, but I don't think that quite is it. Hmm. Living off his lady, pretty much. Trying to be a professional swammer. Which, I just saw a trait. What is... What is... What is this one? Wait, loves to swim? Wait, he needs this one. He's He wants to be a professional swimmer. I forgot this one exists. Yeah, there's nurturing, too. I feel like she could have either nurturing or family-oriented, but maybe not both. I think I'm okay with, like, what she's got. So what if I get rid of Coward and give him Loves to Swim and instead of Swiper, he has Mooch. That's kind of fun. That's a fun lineup. He, he needs to love to swim. And then little guy here. He's a light sleeper, excitable, and an angler. I think all of those are maybe not it. I feel like he should inherit Rebellious from Skip. I'll look at his, like, actual personality, but I feel like... I like it when the kids sort of get traits from their parents, or kind of use their parents as examples. Of what they're... See, he loves... Wait, he loves crime. S little Dustin loves crime. <laughs> this child loves criminal activity. He should be the swiper. I think Dustin's got to be the swiper. And he loves the environment, so maybe he just likes being outside. Oh, is he very... Oh, he's pretty sloppy. Who's... Yeah, he, Brandy and him are the same sloppiness. Also, this child is fit. This child is jacked. <laughs> this child is jacked. He needs violent video games. <laughs> You're right. This young boy with the hell. <laughs> he loves he loves danger. Maybe Daredevil. Maybe he should be rebellious Daredevil swiper. He's just he's just a a mess. He's strong. How do I feel about that? I feel like that could work. I think that's a fun lineup for him. Unless anybody has any other, like, thoughts for what he could have. I feel like that fits him. He only has one body skill and one creativity. I'm gonna hit play. Oh, I gotta delete this guy. My dream man! <laughs> okay, she's... You made this dirty, man. Oh wait, not flush. I'm gonna take clean. In my in my strange view, like on YouTube, I had Skip own a uh one of those money making machines. Do you think he has enough money? No, he doesn't really have enough. I mean, not money. Aspiration rewards. He doesn't have enough for like any of these. What if he like secretly has one of these in the back? Also, I kind of want to change his hair because Brandy's brother here has the same hair as him. Let's change appearance. Also, I'm gonna. S well, I wasn't gonna save. Look at Mr. Skip. 
with Mr. Skip? What kind of hair? I feel like he should still have like a select pack hair, but just a different style or something. You know? Or he could have like something. This is kind of fun too. Like trailer park dude. <laughs> Overgrown trailer park hairdo. Maybe. Does he need a mullet? What if Skit has. I just called him Skit. Skip. Does Skip have a mullet? <laughs> Do you like the long slick back? My nose is itching. Let me see if what other if if it, there's any. Oh, I don't think that looks good. <laughs> that one doesn't look good. There's also this, which is pretty classic looking. Skid skid mark. <laughs> Not a trendy mullet like white trash mullet. Yeah, mullet mullet. <laughs> I don't know if we have any mullet mullets. That one's nice, too. That's a nice mesh. Also, this one. This one's, like, messy. Hmm. I don't think that's quite it. He would still need, like, the, the front put back. Put back? Pushed back. I might change Brandy's brother's hair, too. Oh, this is the Mervy do. This is the, the Mervy lemon bottom do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see, like, this is the trendy mullet, but I don't think that's it. I gotta update this thumbnail. I don't know if I have one that's gonna work. I might give him just that long hair. Hmm. I started a new Sunset Valley and I was like, wow, I wonder what story progression will name the Keaton baby. It went for killer, killer Keaton. <laughs> like the, like the dog. Oh, like a dog. Oh no. Why would it even decide that? I'm going to go with this. I like this. This is a different kind of vibe for him. I guess I'll leave Joe. Don't look at me. Don't look at me like that. Ranahana. Look at me like that. Yeah, I gotta go to class. If y'all are still streaming at five, I'll be back. Okay, have a, have a good class. I don't know. I'm, I might still be live. I think I'll probably go to five hours. We're almost at four hours. Yeah, I think that works for him. It's like a little bit of like a greasy dude look. He was like, why did my hair just change? He was like, what? Why, why did you brush my hair out? What are we doing? We're just sitting watching television? What are we doing? He wants to hit on. Look at these two. I lost Wi-Fi. I don't think you... I don't know if anything really... We changed skits. Skit? I did it again! You know what it is? There's this person that I watch. There's a streamer that I watch who does Red Dead Redemption roleplay. And their character's name is Skit. S-K-I-T. And they do like this funny like Forrest Gump voice for him. And they and his name is Skit. <laughs> That's what I keep calling him. <laughs> now we gotta imagine Skip broke with like Forrest Gump's voice. Okay, why are we in the bathroom with Brother Joe? What's up? What's up with Brother Joe? Chat, we're chatting. Why are we chatting about why are we talking about woohooing with Brother Joe in the bathroom? We're talking about <laughs> Oh, I didn't see that the bubble popped up. I don't think that's far from. Oh, they're gonna go woohoo. Oh, they just got naked. Bro, brother Joe, no. Okay, brother Joe did not witness. Brother Joe was not witness to the sins <laughs> of our bedroom. <laughs> Brother Joe's just gonna watch Vidkin getting abducted on the TV. I think she, she's already pregnant, so she can't get pregnant. Brother Joe, avert your eyes. Brother Joe, avert your eyes. But yeah, we've got a little pool out here. And a bunch of trees. Oh, there's a dog. His name's Max. He's not our dog. My mom always said you should woohoo in the trailer. 
Okay. Well, they did a woohoo. Should we? Maybe I should have him check the newspaper. Oh, I got a little lag there. Where's the newspaper? Oh, Angela's walking by with their cat. Angela, why are you not at school? Okay. Um, Brother Joe decided to come in and talk. Um, let's let's give him a friendly hug and say goodbye. <laughs> when does she have to work? 5 p.m. Yeah, Angela's just vibing with her cat. Just vibing with the cat. Ugh, the, the bathroom's dirty again. Does he? Should he go swimming? Let him get in. I guess she. Oh, she's gonna take a bath. Or no? Why are you taking a bath? You're not even dirty. That's weird. I'm gonna watch him swam. I'm gonna watch him swam. My Sims 4 game, I said a lot trait that uh, was like teen neighborhood and all day, including school hours. All teens walk by the house. That's weird. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, he's swimming with flippy flops on. He's swimming with his flimmy flops on. It's not a crime to take a bath when you're clean. <laughs> I guess so. I guess so. He's having fun. What's he want? He wants to entertain, meet someone new. He wants to be BFFs with Bella and have, well, maybe we'll lock and have three besties. Who are his best? He's got two besties. One is Bella and one is Brandy. Maybe he needs to call up Michael Bachelor and be besties with Mikey. She just did the dirty with Skit. True. <laughs> Said it again. His name's officially Skit now. To be honest, that pool doesn't allow for a lot of swimming in terms of meters. Yeah, true. Like, maybe he's he might not be as prepared as he thinks he is. He's trying his best. He's pretending. Who came to the neighborhood? Oh, every time. It's always, it's always, okay. This is the, this is Dustin Langerak. But every time it's always Ichabod and Osiris. Here, why don't we, why don't you get out? Can we greet? Can I not greet? I can only ask to leave? Why are you being mean to the people? Greet everyone. Yeah, oh, Dustin, I don't know. I gotta fix his hair. Every time I see him, I'm like, I gotta fix his hair. Maybe now that he's finally on a lot right now, I can just do Gussie Up Change. I don't really know what kind of hair he should have. He's kind of a cool looking guy. What kind of hair does he normally have? Does he have like a shaggy or do? Or like... I can pot spot pink soup. Pink soup. He kind of looks good with just like a little swoop back hair. He is Dustin is Langren's Langren? I'm sorry. Kaylin's mom. Dad. <laughs> I need to go to bed. I need to go back to bed. <laughs> I need to go back to bed. Kaylin Langrex, dad. <laughs> Brother? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm a hangerin' for a langerin'. I kinda like this little swoop on him. Oh boy. I don't remember what his hair is in The Sims 3. Which is where these guys appear is in The Sims 3. I might just give him like this little do for now. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, it's a little weird. Dust two Dustins, and he looks like yeah. It's kind of weird. There are things in this world that we will never fully understand. Understand. Fully understand. We want answers. Let's create this. Let's chat. We have worked years to build our credibility. You get out of the pool. Our reputation. Our reputation. Can't remember what what's her brother's name. Um. Parker? Is it Parker? I think her brother's Parker. Think I think. I could well I can't if I made him selectable, I could see what his like his son's name. Actually, why don't I do that just to make sure who's who? Yeah, Parker Parker and Kaylin. Ileana. And she has a sister named Zelda. Yeah. We'll play them eventually. We're just chilling, playing a little oh, kiki sack. It's like you're gonna go to those Mad Lib activities. That's, that's what every, every day, every day, 
in my life is a Mad Lib adventure. <laughs> Every time I try to say anything, there's some pink soup. We gotta invite the, the household. I should know I played too much Sims 3 Sons of Valley. Let's go. Why can he not... Never. What are we hearing? What am I hearing? Okay. Why are you not eating? <laughs> Why do they act so weird? Her? Okay. No, you have some. You know somebody named Zelda. That's interesting. <laughs> Olive has something to say. I should know. I've pluck nutted too much si nut three Sunset Valley. <laughs> anyway, I'm excited about Ichabod living in Pleasant View because if you're not clear, Ichabod Spectre here, him and him and Olive Spectre had a falling out, and she divorced. He divorced her, and now he he took the kids to Pleasant View, so he lives in Pleasant View now. And I'm very excited about Mr. Teefy's being being his own man and not just becoming a, a grave in all inspectors uh, garden oh. now who is this guy who, what do we got going on here uh, Gussie up change appearance Skip is on the brink of recovery <laughs> is that missing texture soup <laughs> it is Look at this guy. I'm just gonna give him a hairdo. That's maybe not the best hairdo. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Okay, Dustin's back. I feel like we need to take Dustin for- Oh, who'd he bring home? This is gonna be... The name is Chloe Gonza. But I feel like this is supposed to be... Someone. Like a, like a pre-made townie or something. Oh, he wants to be friends with Chloe. We could do that. I think you could put in a fancy suit next to Skip's shirtlessness is so funny. Yeah, I know. It's like, this is not the type of place Ichabod is used to being. <laughs> Ichabod went from, like, a very high-class fancy place to this. Um, I'm gonna do a macro. I'm gonna do that. Hi, Trombone Gal. How are you doing? Thank you for the lurk. Osiris is losing it. Oh, is he? Osiris is just chilling out here. Listen to his. I feel like once once Dustin is is a teen, him and Osiris could be besties. Osiris is like the cool kid. Also, Osiris again for those maybe that aren't as familiar. Osiris is our nervous subject. Yeah, he probably was throwing a tantrum. He he. I think his aspirations bad, ma'am. Does Brandy put on a wig for her for for work? Is that how she gets through? I like how her hat has a pizza and her shirt has a hot dog. <laughs> what are you selling? What are you selling? <laughs> okay, have have a good dinner, daydreamer. Uh, wait, anxious subject just came onto the lot. Anxious subject is like a little Easter egg in the. Uh, Anxious subject just showed up while while our the real nervous subject is here. Hello. Intra suspicious. Suspicious. So anxious is is a is a reference to the in like I guess in like the development pictures or like in some of the storytelling pictures or something of the Beaker House the anxious there's so nervous subject shows up as a teenager but in the final cut obviously they made him an adult because i think they realized that it felt weird to have like a teen boy in their custody kind of thing um so 
I think that it was like there was there's sort of I think among some people who are you know big fans of The Sims 2 they they named him anxious subject I don't know if he's actually in the game files as that or not if anybody else knows better that might be able to clarify it but he's he's sort of a a character that's become his own little and I don't know why they chose to put him in the 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 pleasant view pool county pool I'm not really sure that I'm not clear on that either unless he is actually in the game files in pleasant view or something but so they've, they've called him anxious subject he's like the teenage version of nervous so yeah I don't really know that's that's the basics okay these two are making friends I kind of want to take like Dustin out to like a, a park or something somewhere to play he needs fun he's not making friends with this kid very easily maybe they need to just go somewhere else Sims talking my ears kind of a lot okay now he's having a meltdown yeah, he's throwing a tantrum Oh, well, the early houses are better than later ones, true. <laughs> They're just kind of like... I feel like it's a lot of an alternate reality sort of thing. Okay, they seem to be maybe getting along a little bit. Okay. Oh, the bird sound? <laughs> Her making the bird sound? Where's Skip? Where did he go? Oh, there he is. Oh, Brandy's at work. I feel like Brandy was wearing a wig, like she doesn't want to be spotted at work. Okay, we're not really getting along with this girly. I might just say goodbye. Even though he wants to be friends, it's like they're not really getting along. Brandy's sus. I think she is. <laughs> yeah, I was browsing other things with the noise. Yeah, it's kind of there. I was turning them down a little bit. They're they're being talkative. <laughs> being talkative. Oh, why is everybody? What are you arguing about? Who are we arguing? I think I think Dustin and Ichabod are not getting along. He's bragging about having thirty besties. Hey, Skip is Brandy. <gasps> That's Darren. This is Darren Dreamer trying to talk to Brandy. Fascinating. Do we really know Brandy, though? Yeah, that's the question. Brandy's at work, unfortunately. I wish they could talk. I think Dustin's gonna run off on his own in a minute and go do something. Does she have any history? She has three bolts with Darren. <laughs> I was joking. Okay, no, no, it's fine. Yeah. They just sometimes when the Sims get talking and like carrying on, it's like, oh my god, calm down. Let's have him, um,. Am I allowed to? Oh, that's right. I don't think kids are allowed to go on their own. I forgot about that. Maybe... We'll ask everyone to leave and maybe Skip will go on a walk with with, with Dustin somewhere. I think it would be fun if kids could go on their own. There's probably a mod out there for it. Take Dustin with us. Uh, maybe they'll stay in Pleasant View. Is there... I tried to clean up the park a little bit to make it less laggy, but I don't think I did it well enough, so I'm not going to try. Hmm. I don't know where to go. I think we'll stay in Pleasant View. Maybe we'll just go... Which one has... I think this one... Has a swing set? But yeah, what would Brandy be hiding? If Brandy's hiding something, he wants to talk to Brandy. Dance with Brandy. What if Brandy's the shady one? Instead of or what if it what if it ends up being that Brandy gets with D Darren and then kills Skip to to be free from him? <laughs> you know, or or Darren secretly uh convinces her to to do it or something? Hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Okie dokie. Yeah, I think there's a lot of people that think that Brandy did something. Oof, we're chugging as we load onto the lot. Who's loading in here? Jet Beanie. That man's name is Jet Beanie. 
Yeah, I think a lot of people think assume she. Yeah, there are there's swing sets here. Here you go, kid. Go play on the swing set. Swing on the swing set while daddy talks to people. Oof. Oh my god, we chugging. Why are we chugging on this lot? <laughs> also, hello. <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> Skip to Brandy. In another dimension, you killed me, right, babe? <laughs> I had this weird dream last night, babe. <laughs> what? Oh my god, I thought that was his hair. I thought this was his hair, like the spots and then like the... Oh my god. This child. Dustin's struggling. Who is this? Dior? This child? This girlie's name is Dior. Hi, Dior. It's great, Dior Mc McLaughlin? <laughs> Not McLaughlin. Oh, there's Parker. I think I need to fix Parker's hair, too, because I don't think he quite has the right hair. Oh, that other girlie's back. Chloe's back. So fashion. Uh, where did where did the child we were just talking to go? Who's this? Easter? Oh, my God. Little Dustin's having a meltdown. Great. Why aren't you greeting? Or go play with Chloe. I don't know. <laughs> this child. <laughs> Never seen... Yeah, I think... I don't really know how they did it exactly. It actually... It kind of breaks the lighting, though. Like, there's some weird lighting issues. Parker has a cap on in Sims 3. Okay, good to know. That guy's floating. Who floating? <laughs> no body, literally. Wait. I didn't see. I didn't see. <laughs> Let's see, Gary, uh, Parker. I'm gonna gussy up, change appearance. Let's change Parker's. See, I don't think this is, he doesn't have like curly hair, I don't think. Oh, by the door? Oh, somebody's got, I don't think that's quite the hat we're looking for. Yeehaw, Parker. Bucket hat, Parker. Uh. Uh, I get so used to seeing weirdo Calicundi and Sims that seeing the normal ones is weird. Yes, it's true. It's fun, but it's true. Also, this actually that, that could maybe work. I think there's other hats hiding in here. That one's kind of fun. You could still have like wavy hair and like a cool hat. A turned around cap. Okay. I don't know if I have one that I'll like. I like this one. Oh, there is this one. Wait, there is a turned around cap. <laughs> Not the Calicundian nut. <laughs> Uh-oh, you're restarting your downloads folder. I know the pain. I think I'm going to give him this because this is a turned around cap. There we go. Okay. Dustin, please. I need. I wanted you to make friends. Just swing, just play. Oh, please look, the head, a door, please look. Oh, yeah. Okay. He does not look happy. Thor. I do not know how to say his last name. Med Jug Orak. Yeah, I do have some broken CC floating around. I'll just give him something. There we go. He got a body back. He got a body back. Because I have a broken... He's got broken CC. <laughs> He's slim fit. <laughs> Not that. Not his father pushing the... Okay. We might have to... We might have to go back home. Because this is a fail. We'll just have him go home and play at home. It'd probably be easier. I wanted him to, like, go meet people. But it's just not working out. Not working out. <laughs> I like Skip. It is nice that he isn't, you know, dead. <laughs> yeah. I like that he's also not dead. I think he's fun to explore as a character. Um, Because, yeah, I feel like he doesn't really get a lot of attention. That's the fun thing about these early hoods is getting to play some of these dead 
uh, ancestors that are no longer dead. You going? Okay. Well, that was a that was a flop. Dun dun dun. For now. For now. Stop. <laughs> You are you, are you want you are you team skip lives? Yeah. Also, skip was six, so it's probably not a good idea for him to go out. Also, this teddy bear got dragged outside. Oh, where did the oh? Whoops. Please don't kill him. He actually gets a section gets second chance. Yeah. Oh my god! If Brandy somehow dies, oh my god! Wait, that'd be kind of a fun flip. But I also love Brandy too much. Uh oh, just because skip. Is only lightly sick doesn't mean Skip shouldn't take it lightly. Their flu has worsened again. We gotta sleep, Skip. We gotta go to sleep. Skip casually dies. Just go play with toys. You're such a miserable little brat, Dustin. <laughs> Why do you have to be like this, Dustin? Why can't you just be normal, Dustin? Randy got 168 bucks. Oof, she's very tired. She's going to bed. I feel like her I feel like her her wig is sewn into the hat. Like I feel like that's the that's what it is. I like that they have two different random lights in here. I'm gonna delete the overhead light, because I'm fussy about that. I like the bedrooms to have like more lamp light. Brandy, what are you doing? I swear to God, she's gonna get out. She's gonna get up, get her pregnancy bump, and then pass out. That's what's gonna happen. Where are you going? Are you gonna go watch? Te Why? Oh, turn off. Tur <laughs> that was such. A Why, ma'am? <laughs> she got up to turn off the TV. <laughs> Can you just? Okay. <laughs> Hi, party. How are you? The scream. I don't know why she would like why would she have needed to turn that off? I don't understand. <laughs> Butt spot, please. He also wants to be friends with Jennifer. Mm -hmm. He's a B plus now from going to school. <sighs> they sleeping. I guess I could save. I mean, they don't- they're not terrible on cash. They got 900 bucks. I just spit on my microphone. That was gross. <laughs> DMI. <laughs> but Spot was real excited to say hi. Thank you for the hydrate. <laughs> I need to rehydrate after spitting on everything. I don't know what I'm gonna have for- oh, there's the bump. There's the bump. There's the bump. With a little one on the way. With a little one on the way. Oh my god, I gotta run an ad again? I gotta run an ad again. I'm sorry if you get stuck behind that ad. We're just gonna do boring stuff. I won't do anything important behind the ad. Hopefully nothing- that's the hard part. Hopefully nothing random <laughs> happens behind the ad. You put ID on your stuff. Isn't bad. <laughs> Everything you do is important. Same. <laughs> Sam. <laughs> Sam. Yelling. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know. I guess we're gonna have to keep checking for jobs for Skip. I feel like we should do it the slow way instead of just forcing him. I feel like... I feel like we should give him um like make him look in the in the newspaper also yeah go to bed she's just like she's like i need to get up and take a bath is almost dying of of sleep exhaustion <laughs> the, the aggressive tone i know oh <laughs> well the what butt spot al alvernut not the alvernut Okay, yeah, you're literally- you're done. Just go with the- you're gonna pass out again. 
Ma'am. Ma'am. Stop. Why? Brandy is Brandy is all of us staying awake watching watching a stream <laughs> when we should be sleeping. <laughs> Passing out at the desk. Do you imagine if her toilet was so filthy it emitted visible fumes? Oh god. Like that? Like can you oh god. I mean like Ew. <laughs> is there even like how how would that even happen in real life? Like how bad would it have to be? You know? Like wow. Oh my god. Now her bladder is bad. I think it's because she's sick and stuff. Look, her bladder is bad. Okay. Um, their house is filthy also. None of them are particularly Wow, his his comfort and social just boosted from that. Drink chemical warfare. <laughs> I went downstairs to try and get a drink. My dad asked me for help on Spanish Duolingo. Oh, <laughs> oh boy. Oh, Skip got healthy. Yeah, we're just kind of trying to survive the night, but Brandy is making it very difficult. Brandy is making it difficult. Brandy, there she goes. <laughs> Please clean that toilet before you use it again. Nope, she said, I, I, one step ahead of you. <laughs> one, Brady said, one step ahead of you. Now she's brushing her teeth. Okay. You wanna, we'll just, can you just clean up a little bit? I know you're not the neatest sim, but maybe just a little bit. Jesus Christ. That's how you get yeast. Maybe Brandy wants yeast. Maybe Brandy, maybe Brandy wants a yeast infection. <laughs> Welcome back, Danny. <laughs> Welcome back, Danny. <laughs> She's a mess. Okay, can you mop up and then take a goddamn bath? Oh, <laughs> look at the baby yeast. <laughs> oh. She, the thing is, is Brandy's met sloppy. Brandy doesn't want to clean. But I think she's gonna have to. We talking yeast? <laughs> we talking about this toilet and the things that it would do to you? Talking about the dangers of sitting on this toilet. The stream chat. <laughs> I don't know. It always ends up in a weird place, doesn't it? Why did you not? Why, sir? My Sims are are being a pain in the butt. That toilet would take me out. I would not use it. I'd rather- I'd rather- much rather go outside in the bushes. I don't, he, my sims are obsessed with eating stinky soup. Uh, just have some instant meal or something, bro. He wants to be friends with Ichabod. And have a party. Ooh, I kind of want to lock in and have a party. That'd be kind of fun. I feel like these guys could party. I feel like this- I think- I think Skip and Brandy know how to party. You know what I mean? Like we need to we need to like buy buy a keg. I think I've never had a party at the Brokes. Interesting. I think they could party. I think we gotta buy one of them little kegs and put it out here. And then like a little radio. Everybody could be chilling out here. Do we have enough money? Yeah. Like they'd have this chilling out here. Obviously it's raining right now. Yeah, they got kind of a cute little pool. It's definitely not a place that anybody would die in. Like, it's definitely a safe little pool that doesn't cause death. Yeah, <laughs> could there not be a pool disaster at the party? That's, 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 you're, you're not wrong. That might be a danger. Yeah, too many sims trying to use the ladder in the tide pool. We'll have to just let it, let it see, we'll see what happens. You know? Sometimes you just gotta let Jesus take the wheel. <laughs> <laughs> you know? What is this? <laughs> there we go. We'll have a fun little party. He's a popularity sim. Um, It's just predictable in Sims 2 routing. It is. It is. We we'll just have to let him go. We'll see who who's he gonna invite. It's Sunday, so maybe if the rain could frickin' stop, they could have a little later party. Maybe Dustin can get Angela to come over. 
ma'am she she tried she just she 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 took that brush and switched it around for 0.5 seconds and said poof that's too much for me <laughs> and then she's i'm going to bed <laughs> okay okay ma'am all right what do you what what could you do what can you do what do you do well <laughs> skip <laughs> what is it that you do well skip <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for hanging out, Token Funny. Have a good one. Oh, <laughs> She's my spirit animal, me. <laughs> I used to get so mad at my Sims whenever they did that. Yeah, it's like, ugh. But like, she's miserable right now. We're kind of in the hunger energy cycle. As a child, I would torture them for that. <laughs> As a child, you would take away the ladder. The bathroom, man. I know. The bath. Everybody feels the same about the bathroom. Everyone feels the same about the bathroom. <laughs> well, Dusty's awake. I like calling Dustin Dusty. I like that idea. We gotta call his... his call Sim. Let's call his friend, his little friend, uh, Angela over. He's excited about the rain. Kept trying to be charismatic next to that stank. <laughs> yeah. Uh, little Angela. Invite over. What's Angela gotta say? Oh, nice of you to invite me. I'll just gussy up and come over. <laughs> like, like others said in the chat, military grade stank. Ultra stank, yeah. <laughs> Ultra stank. It's rough. Oh. oh no, my mouse is stuck. There we go. Yeah, maybe if the rain actually stops, which actually did it, I think the rain actually stopped, so that's good. Maybe he can throw a party then. Since we can wait till a little bit later. Oh, Angela's here. Gotta greet Angela. I like the Lilith Dustin combo in my game. Yeah, that's cool. That's a good I think that is a good pairing. I don't know how we're gonna turn out with it. Right now I just I just see him as friends. I don't know what you know, I wait till they're teenagers to do much else. <laughs> okay. I think oh that's right. Her 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 little shoes are like cursed, aren't they? They're like broken. I don't think they're supposed to be like that skin colored section on the shoes. I think. <laughs> Not Dusk Nut. Little in the dust. Oh, they became besties. What does he want to do? Tell a joke. He said he's got a joke prepared. Maybe they can run around playing cops and rabbers. Playing caps and rabbers. Yeah. Well, I think you're you're pretty successful with that. I feel like he. I feel like. Um. Skip would have like a body workout machine or something out here too. Like he feels like he's got it like, but he feels like he's got it like right out front where he can like stare down the neighbors while he's doing a workout. You know. Oop. What is the cheat in Sims who can control and move and delete Sims? Um. So yeah, there's bullcrap testing cheats enabled. That one lets you like make them selectable. Um. Then. Yeah, true is turning on, false is turning off. Nut, d ignore butt spot. Nut equals turn on. <laughs> and then move objects on is the other one. I don't know what the full version of move objects. I think it's move objects on. That one lets you pick them up and like move them. And then also delete them. You can also delete them by shift clicking on them and doing like an error. Yeah. Nut equals turn on, nut. <laughs> Oh, we don't have m enough money for- Oh, we have this cheap workout machine. This one's like junky. What? What is wrong? The baby. She fuss. I'll put a little workout machine here. I'm gonna work out. I feel like he wants body skill too. I feel like he's running around in his PJs. Like, who this? Gene Bond. 
Gene, the way they ran away from Gene, what? Oh. D Skip? Do you think Skip is secondary romance? What, does he have a secondary right now? I feel like he would. He doesn't. You wanna go down? I don't know. I feel like I could give him... Oh, the newspaper's here? I can I can have him look at the newspaper. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like he could be a little troublemaker. Look out for a little bit. Playing cops and rabbits. <laughs> so the, the toilet looks like a gr toilet monster that spit green slime. Maybe that's what it's meant to look like. Maybe that's how they bought it. Maybe that's how they bought it. Okay, buddy, we're gonna have you take a break and look into. Can you? Can you? Can you? Oh, she's awake. What are you doing? Oh, Brandy. Brandy woke up and said, I need some booze. <laughs> That's the brand. Nickelodeon Slime Toilet. Full time. <laughs> I hate Nickelodeon Slime so much. That was a bad era. My gummy hit. <laughs> oh my. Business reporter. Look again. Uh, oceanography. Everything's super funny right now. <laughs> nice. Private school career as headmaster? Hmm, I don't think any of those were a skip thing. She's... Brandy? <laughs> I don't think that's good for the baby, Brandy. Is this gonna be Bo? What if it ends up being a little girl? Would we name it something uh, Bo-like? Because technically this baby would be Bo. If it's a boy. No, is it Bo? Yeah, it's Bo. Right? And then, yeah, because then Bo's a toddler in the regular one. In, like, regular Pleasant View at the start. Bo Peep. <laughs> we can still do Bo. That's true. Bo could work for a girly. That's true. Or you could do something with a B-E-A, like Beatrice or whatever, but I like Bo. I remember when I was a child first playing... Uh, first playing The Sims 2, I used to say B-U, B-U, that's what I called him was B-U, <laughs> which is like so much extra work, because <laughs> I didn't know the name Bo, <laughs> so it means beautiful or handsome. Booey. <laughs> A booey? Look, you want to go downstairs? I can let you down. I might have to go let Olive downstairs quickly. Should I, should I do another, let's see if a fire starts while I'm away moment? I used to call it- I used to call it that too. You too! Then my older sister corrected me one time. That's funny. If, um, girl, then Betty. Betty's also good. I've done Betty before for un- unborn baby broke. I've done that. Or Bella, in honor of Twilight Mission, was true. Although we have Bella Goth in town, so that might get weird. Because it sounds like that in Portuguese. Oh. Interesting. Why is why is why is why did, why is Angela holding the red solo cup? Is Angela drinking? <laughs> is Angela drinking? Then we'd have three Bellas. Okay, I'm gonna go let Olive downstairs very quickly. Ah, <laughs> Hello, sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> I was letting all of my doggy downstairs. 
Um, hello, thank you very much for the for the raid. Charlie is Scottish. <laughs> I know there's not a fire. I ran up the stairs. <laughs> I like dying. Sam, how dare you dis how dare you disappear for three seconds? <laughs> hello, hello. How are you? Thank you very much for the raid. How are you doing? Hold down one moment. Our streamer is away. <laughs> I turned. It came back on right. Yeah. Okay. Then this numbed me up. <laughs> he had a vendetta. I, it so swole my ear closed. Oh, when I had to do dental work the other day, my ear got got um got some of the novocaine. It was weird. It felt very strange. Anyway, hi Mac. Hello. <laughs> Olive oil wanted to go downstairs. No fires happened. <laughs> also, hi Skinny Miss Fortune. So I didn't rework this house. This house was so we're in the early pleasant view. Um, so we it, the the creator did their own changes to the houses. So that's um this is their little makeover. I didn't change it. Uh it's really nice. I really like it. I see James married on Monday. Cool. Very cool. My ear doesn't ache. I can it cannot ache. No sensation, only swole. Yeah. Mine was like half numb. So it almost liked it almost like it, it, it was like it felt really weird. Yeah, I don't know how to describe it. It almost itched or something because it was like half of it was messed up. Oh, I just realized, look at all the kids' stuff. Mm. I opted to not get any since I'm going to be back tomorrow. Oh. Interesting. <laughs> look, it's Chav boy. Look at look at Angel. I didn't know the kids could drink the juice. Oh, the way she just burped was feral. That was rancid. Did you just see her burp? Did y'all? <laughs> Angela just burping after drinking out of a solo cup in the Brokes backyard at the trailer park. <laughs> you couldn't hear it. Oh no. <laughs> you could see it. <laughs> Turn the sound up just a little bit. This is why Daniel hates us. See if she does it again. And she's getting drunk at the at the at the brokes. <laughs> I can turn the volume up a little bit. It's always so hard to balance it. <laughs> Angela's being unsupervised. My cat came into the bathroom. Wait, wait. My cat came into the bathroom and sat on the vacuum cleaner. It's his worst enemy. Oh no. That's funny. Okay, can we. What are we doing? We're just kind of idling here. Can we answer the phone? Randy's not dead, so that's a good start. He's barely alive. I associate those cups with American party movie parties. Yeah, solo cups. Yeah. Brandy available? No. Brandy's very much asleep. Angela's so on brand right now, you think so? Mm. Um, I'm gonna put away some leftovers, buddy. Oh, we need to throw a party. That bathroom is so preppy, you think so? <laughs> you think it's preppy? That's a fun, that's a fun word. My naive ass didn't know it was for containing booze. Oop. <laughs> Oop. Sam, please in the bathroom. Oh, she got bumped. Love, I, honestly, I love how everybody just is obsessed with the bathroom and how disgusting it is. I think that's hilarious. But see, like, here's the thing is... He's, he, I guess Skip could clean it. Brandy's very not clean. Angela's so... You move. There you go. There you go. Okay, can we... Okay, whatever. It's working. <laughs> Angela always gave me 
the vibe um, of a kid who's absolutely unhinged, would do shrooms in college, but her grades are so good and parents haven't got a clue. Yeah, you're right. I can see that. This is how the bathroom is all the time when I play this household. Yeah, it's... Honestly, I'm just letting it exist. She, Brandy's very sloppy. I'm gonna have her call Jennifer. Actually, that's not- that's a lie. I'm gonna have him throw a party. I'm gonna have Skip throw a party. Sports party? What is, like, a sports party, actually? I don't really know- do they, like, watch TV? Uh, Angela is a bit like the child trying her best to be the golden child, but actually is severely mentally unstable. Yeah, I could see that. Watching sports? Okay. I kind of don't want him to be inside watching. Wait, let me do a throw party. Just do a house party. Hopefully they'll be drawn outside more. Um, we'll get Michael down here. Bella Goth? Sure, why not? Um, maybe we'll get... He doesn't know everyone, does he? Nina Caliente is literally a teenager. This cat? Arlene? Derek? Maybe we'll teleport some folks? Mortimer? I don't think Mortimer would be de Who's down for a... Maybe Dustin? Who's down for a party at the trailer park? Daniel? Eh, we'll just do that. Maybe we'll teleport a few folks? Her brother? Yeah, that's the thing. He doesn't know her. I wish I could teleport him, though. Maybe, what if Dustin cleans it? <laughs> I don't think he will. This is a, um, this is a radio. This, this amplifier, it's a custom radio that just looks like an amplifier. I just think it's kind of neat. Maybe they've got it rigged up to work like a radio. <laughs> I think Chad gags every time Sam pan the camera to the, to the stank. Yeah, I think so. I take a big whiff. <laughs> the stank is me, y'all. I forgot to put on the other room. I thought it was attached to the juice. Oh, yeah, yeah, because I kind of set it up like that a little bit. Okay, the party is technically happening. Did nobody show to our party? Oh, no, Bella's in here. Oh, they're here. Folks, some of the folks showed it up. Some of the folks showed it up. Do you want to... Let's teleport some folks. Spawn Sim. I'd like to get... You're gonna die up there. Mm. I'm Katya. <laughs> <laughs> I just buy a new toilet. There's no saving it. <laughs> uh, oops, I actually didn't mean to invite Mary Sue, but that's okay. Um, Dreamer, I'm gonna let Darren show up. Where are the burbs? There. Jennifer. I love Jennifer show up because Brandy wants to be friends with Jennifer. Maybe Mary Sue brought Angela. True. True. Look how she's like glamorous. I know she's so she's fantastic. The kids are just drawn to her. She's bored of the children. She's bored of the children. I think he needs to jump in the pool, and like invite everybody to swim with him. I think that's what needs to happen. Let's see. I'm gonna even out some of Brandy's needs. Just for the heck of it. She wants to be friends with this girly. No, oh no, I accidentally hit develop crush. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I accidentally hit develop crush. So she has a crush on Jennifer. I did not mean to hit that. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh god. I'll have to finish the rest of the stream later. Hope all goes well. Have a good rest of the stream. Thank you for hanging out, Comey. I appreciate your help. I'll see you later. Okay, well, Brandy has a secret crush. Oh, Darren's into Brandy. Of course he is. Of course he is. Who can come swim with us? Ask to join. Ask to join. Ask to join. Ask to join. Such scandal. 
He's just screaming for everybody from his tiny pool. He's like, come swim with me! Come swim with me! Uh -oh, everybody's, in, everybody's in the way of everybody. Oh, somebody come swim! Heck yeah! We're getting in the pool! <laughs> pool party! <laughs> <laughs> this is not a, a disaster waiting to happen or anything. You coming in? Coming in, Mary Sue. <laughs> this is stressful. I don't like this. <laughs> okay. See, look, they can get out. <laughs> I feel like I'm them quitting. <laughs> I think they're fine. They don't even want to stay in. Probably too cold or something. Okay, they're having fun out there. <laughs> That's right, baby. Oh, oh, look at look at Mr. Michael and his speedo. Mr. Michael and his speedo. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Skip, you can't just do that, buddy. I know you don't understand, but you can't just do that, Skip. <laughs> You can't just do that, buddy. <laughs> you got a history that you don't even understand. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to get these girls friends. Give <laughs> trauma skip, please. <laughs> Premonition. <laughs> oh my fucking god, he fucking did. Who's out here? Oh, oh, they're not enemies anymore? Wait, Mary Sue and Bella were en enemies, but it just ended? They just ended their feud in the trailer park? Okay. Brandy, I'm gonna give you a break because you're a mess. I'm also gonna have you, like, gussy up changing your everyday. And maybe talk with this man. This kind man. Do what he's got to say. I know, Brandy needs to learn to use the toilet. What's happening is somebody's in here taking a bath. Angela's taking a bath and... Probably catching some diseases in our in our tub. Also, it's lagging. I don't know. We're chugging a little bit. I think it's these guys trying to get in, and it's like lagging. You know what we need in this household? Oh man, I just barely don't have enough for it. I think I'm gonna delete this because nobody even cares about it. Okay. Oops. This is a porta potty. <laughs> a porta potty. We're gonna put it. We're gonna throw a porta potty back here. We can we can share. Tell a tree. I could. We might have to put a couple out, but we'll see. There we go. They're headed for. She's headed for the porta potty. That should help. This is um. So actually, this is a conversion from one of the stories games. Also, I'm actually gonna delete that tree because it's in the way. So I think this is either from pet stories or life stories. It was it was in the PC version of those games. Um, it's, it works really well. The only thing is, it does have like a little like you can spy on your Sims, which is kind of weird, but it it works very well. <laughs> I like it. It's very useful. Okay, I think it might be pet stories. I don't think it tells me. It doesn't really tell me, but I know it's for one of those. Do you want to like, just clean up a little brandy? It is from pets. Okay. I know the skylight in the porta potty. <laughs> okay, yeah. I think it would make sense. The party's not bad. I guess that's better than nothing. I want these two to just like get to know each other just because you know like they can be buddies they can be friends I hear fighting oh they're enemies again Mary Sue and Bella are enemies <laughs> that was weird is pet, is pet stories worth it as a game it's, oh there's a fight it's okay I don't think it's like I don't think it's like the... I'm trying to remember it. It's been a while since I played it. I think it's it's fun. I feel like there was... I liked it more than... The, I feel like the, the tier list for me is Castaway is the best, and then Pet Stories, and then Life Stories. Because I feel like life, life Stories are just like... 
I hate everybody who's involved. Like, all of the characters were insufferable. And the story was kind of dumb. But then, like... Pet Stories had a little bit more going on. It was a little bit more interesting. There was a little bit more drama. I think it was fun. Um, yeah, that's kind of my feeling of it. Yeah, it forces weird choices and it's just like, I don't know, there's just like a lot of weirdness with it. Where do knows Bella is Daniel's? Oh, you're right. Actually, you know what? You're right because the reason that they're enemies is because she caught she caught Daniel and Herb Oldie fooling around with Bella. And that's literally why. That's the moment that she learned that Daniel was cheating was because of Bella. So that's actually why they hate each other when we were playing them a couple of streams ago. <laughs> the breeder bed from Life Stories. I have it in this game. <laughs> I have the breeder bed. Where is it? It's too expensive for this household. It's literally the most expensive bed. The Fertilinator. I have it. <laughs> I just saw Skippy thought he was dead. That's what we were saying. We're like, Skippy, you can't do that to us. <laughs> Skippy, you can't do that to us, buddy. <laughs> you can't do that to us, buddy. Looks like he's got his feet stuck. Like, is he okay? You okay, Skip? He's filthy. Like... Sir? Hey, Brandy, is Skip available? Nah. He's he's having a moment in the... I think he might be... I don't know what he's doing. I think he took some some shrooms or something. Sorry, a what? <laughs> the Fatilinator. You know. You know. Oh, my God. Somebody's out here crushing cups against their head. This is kind of a fun little party. Yeah, I don't know if he needs to just... He's floating on back. I think he needs to just, like, chill. Like, get up before he actually dies. I also am thinking about getting rid of this tub and buying them a shower if we have enough money. Because I just would rather have a shower. Hey, baby, Goral. <laughs> why, don't you, why don't we take this to the Fertilinator? <laughs> you know. I'm gonna give him... Or, you know what I might actually do? We'll save some cash, we'll give him this one. Why not? Congratulations on hosting a terrific party! Okay. The people, the people enjoyed your party. Oh, he wants to influence. Influence someone to entertain and talk? Okay. Oh! Oh! Skip! <laughs> Skippy! <laughs> Skippy! <laughs> <laughs> Something's wrong. <laughs> Skip. <laughs> Smart financial decisions. Slay. I like that spelling of slay. <laughs> it was terrific, not terrifying. Terrific. Did Skip die yet? <laughs> I don't know. He might be on his way right now. <laughs> he was laying on his back in the hot tub. For, I mean, not in the hot tub. In the... Uh, he, was, he, he was laying on his back in the, the pool for like 10 years. And then I just made him get out. Why is it something wrong happens to your game when I return? I don't know. It's a good point. I, I know how to fix this, but it's really funny just to let it happen. Because there's oh, he's smoking pot. Maybe he, maybe that's what it is. He's broken. My skip, he's broken. Maybe he takes a shower? No. Um I know that I can use the I think the bat box or whatever it's called, I can remove stuck F SFX. Um, it's this guy. Put this guy somewhere. Just hide it on top of there. He was sitting on the weird hippie bean bag with the weird effect, yeah. Fix um, stuck diners? Okay. Fix. Um. Nuke stuck SFX. There it goes. He's gone. He's cleared. Skip is broken. Skip broke is skip broken. <laughs> he skip broken. Hysterical is not the, <laughs> enough to describe. Honestly, it, it works for him. I think we're gonna be seeing the baby pretty quick here. Honestly, oh my god, I just zoomed in. I'm surprised that, um, she has survived this far. 
Thank you very much for the follow. Thank you, thank you. Maybe just because I get sleepy too. <laughs> it's funny. Okay, they're going to sleep. Everybody's look at everybody just naturally going to sleep at midnight. Okay, we had a raging trailer park party. We had a raging Cajun party. I'm gonna move this over here like that. We'll just let this feels like it should just stay here. Like that feels like the vibe. Should I move this? What if what if the what if the, the what if this is just here? Does that seem that feels like trailer park vibes to just have the porta potty on the way into the trailer? <laughs> you know, you know, it's gonna run out. Wait, what's gonna run out? Brandy always has the worst survival skills when pregnant for me. That's funny. I mean, her luck, her luck's gonna run out. Is it just oh the juice? The juice is gonna run out. You're right. Just me or the Sims seems too bad taking care of themselves. I don't know. I learned the hard way. <laughs> what does that mean? What happens when it runs out? Yeah, it might depend on their. I also feel like it depends on their neatness level and stuff like that. Might be wrong. I'm gonna just um. Another little cereal? Oh, you're already headed for something. Also, little Dustin needs to do his homeworks. He should do his homeworks. Yeah, true. My traits might affect things. I don't know. Dustin, I was. Oh, I didn't know Dustin was sick too. OMG. OMG. <laughs> but it's 2 a.m. No fair. Making up a 2 a.m. to eat cereal. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? I, I don't really ever wake up that early to like. The only time I'd wake up that early is if Olive woke me up to, to make her. to let her go out. <laughs> Everybody, everybody relating to the to the two a.m. <laughs> Get an olive oil. Oh, the child is here. You want to do homework? <laughs> you ever wake up parched like you fell asleep in a desert? I used to when I was younger. I don't as much now, for some reason. I did my homework at 2 a.m. Oh, yeah. I remember always doing that as a kid, and I, I really shouldn't. Like, I would I would be, like, doing my homework at night. And then I would say, oh, I, it's okay. I can finish it in the morning before school. And then it was just, like, the cram to try and get up early and do your homework. And it was, like, a mess. <laughs> if we don't, but spot. No lie, I nut my homework at 2 a.m. But spot. That's but I have a cat, so I get woken up at 3 a.m. every night. Yeah, Olive is Olive's been good the last few nights. Um she hasn't been too bad. Yeah, I wonder if it I think it also maybe has to do with the way you sleep. If you're like a a mouth breather, or you know what I mean? Or you have you snore or stuff like that that maybe would make your mouth drier. Um Don't nut your homework, kids. <laughs> I need you to do your homework, little guy. He wants an A-plus in school. Hi, Brandy. Are you alive? You seem to be alive. That's a good start. That's a good start to the morning, is to live. Oh, I'm not going to save right now. I wonder to just have cereal. Ma'am, why are you so... Oh, you're giving birth. Okay. I guess that's an okay excuse to just be so insufferable. Hashtag ins inspirational. <laughs> Do it. Don't nut it. <laughs> yeah, Dustin's got his little PJs. Cats do that crazy cat. Or just one baby. Oh, oh it's a cob. Is it a mom? Oh, it's a mom. 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 It's 
so loud. Okay, sorry. <laughs> Turn her down. There we go. Baby boy. Oh, it's a proper bow. It's a proper little bow. That seems they're so loud. Yeah, I forget to turn it down. Usually I turn her down. Blue eyes, baby boy. I know we got a little brandy, little brandy boy. I swear to God, if she does a little spin and has another baby. Okay, <laughs> just surprise twins. I know brandy's one pregnancy away from Kenan. Yeah, I think she's waddling because she was still like, sometimes they're still in the pregnancy mode. What? Wait. Did you know if they eat cheesecake in The Sims 2, they get twins? Oh, I feel like I have heard that. I don't th I think she stopped now. Sometimes when they're fresh off of the baby popping out, they still waddle a little bit. I think she stopped now. Look at this cat. Moody cat. Hi, Moody cat. I will say I like the idea of this awning, but it does annoy me. In, in gameplay, I might have to delete it. That it's just like here in my way, you know? I think for... Oh. I really like it though. Hmm. Yeah, I wish they'd go away. Is there... Yeah, there's a newspaper. I might do like a little, like an artificial awning. Who's true trainer I follow on TikTok? Um, she'd do it for twins. Oh, okay. Interesting. There's also just like the force twins cheat. <laughs> but I guess it depends on how you like to play. Um... Um, um, what am I looking for? This one, I guess. I'm just gonna do something like this for right now. Whoops. And just have like a little awning. <laughs> Sitting Nuddle. Butt spot. Um, thank you for the save game. I will do that. There we go, why not? Well, it's kind of there. It's got like a little edge. But Spot is, is a mess. Also save game. Bum -a -bum -bum. There we go. Why does he want to be friends with Dustin Langerak? She wants to be friends with Dustin. New nickname for oil? No. <laughs> How old is Ms. Oil? I think she's like six now. She's five or six, I think. Okay, Dustin's healthy, but somebody isn't. I'm gonna have to ask you to just clean up, ma'am. I'm gonna clean up. Also, I was mistaken. I, um... I thought that I mentioned I was talking about Echo the pony and I said I think she's like 15 or 16 or something well I did the we did the proper math with the vet and stuff because we were talking about it with the vet and she's actually 20 <laughs> she's actually 20 the, the pony <laughs> um almost the same same as my kitty oh, okay oh your corgi pepper is six interesting Almost the same as my kitty, not cool. Not this. Not this, bud spot. <laughs> I'm gonna save. I think I am gonna get ready. We're gonna watch some machinimas. I think we're gonna get ready to, to be done for the night. We're past five hours. It's almost 6 p.m. my time. Um, I'm getting hungry. I think we'll save. I think this might be a good stopping point. Monday in the morning, so the next time we play this, this town, we'll continue throughout the week for these guys to Wednesday. Um, why don't we, let's pick another machinima. -er. Pick another one that looks good. Maybe we'll watch a couple of them. Maybe we'll watch a few. We watched this one just now. This one's interesting. This was the lost one. 
Um, Summer Dreams, Episode 1, Sims 2 Machinima. This one was interesting because it said, Genre, Fever Dream Level Voice Acting. I watched the entire thing and still have no clue what just went down. <laughs> Ten minutes long. I, I think I need to check this one out. Voice acting and I'm there, you know? Oh my god. Noise, please, stop. Holy crap, Ola. Okay. Machinima time. Machinima time. Twelve years ago. 2011. Our first episode. We really worked hard since this, it's our first episode ever. Enjoy. Okay. Finally, ep episode one of that crazy dizzy romantic comedy is here. Angel is the new student at El Alteza High Academy. She quickly realizes this is not an ordinary school. Okay, I don't know if I want too many spoilers. I guess I won't read all of it. Are we ready for a possibly cursed machinima? I mean, isn't that what we really want in the end? Is a, is a cursed machinima? This one already seems like it's starting out dramatically. Let's see. Just a little loud. What? Okay, it's a very, very dramatic intro <laughs> so far. <laughs> if it ain't cursed, it ain't machinima. You're right. Oh, we're still at the intro. Oh, God. Mid Summer Night Dreams may contain... Wait. Wait a minute. <laughs> okay. Oh, God. What are we in for? Wait a minute. <laughs> what are we in for? <laughs> wait. <laughs> Hold on. I gotta just... I just gotta... Okay, wait a minute. I am very uncomfortable with the energy that <laughs> wait was created in the studio today. Okay. Let's, let's try that again. Yeah. <laughs> I don't... I'm uncomfy. I need an adult. <laughs> Not the olive oil. <laughs> oh, okay. We've got the... I'm going to wait for a little olive. Hello, little olive. I can see you're on the screen right now. The guy's definitely high or trying to sound high, you know? Is there... Is there subtitles? Okay. Apparently there's... There's captions. Are you just going to let her go? It's too late for that. Okay, let me try. Okay. <laughs> There's subtitles? <laughs> Chris Smith. Okay, it got loud. I can't hear without subtitles. Okay, this little, this little guy. <laughs> I'm in a long intro. Another long intro. Wild. Are these people's names? Wild? One, the other one was Law. Dolly. Okay. <laughs> Could this be a full song? I don't... Sounds like a weird... Yeah, I know. Can I maybe go... Okay, we're still at the intro? Okay, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Who is he? Who is that guy? There's a flower shop? Like a sea, send help. I know. Is this one rushed? I can't hear the sound very loud because my sleeping... Okay, yeah. No, it's in English. <laughs> it's 
it's in english allegedly <laughs> um they're just they're they're i think they're trying to make voices and the voices are are, are coming off weird like they're they're like kind of sound like they're not projecting their voice do i need to maybe i can turn it up a little bit too if y'all are there the the english is low like the voices are low i'm gonna turn it up a bit too and like the balance of the audio is a little weird I'm, hold on. I'm gonna do something very quickly. I'm gonna move myself up a little so you can kind of see. <laughs> you can kind of see the subtitles a little bit better, so I don't cover them so badly. I feel dizzy, like, for real. This is weird. Uh. I mean, I will say they, they definitely... Th there was some work put into it. <laughs> I... <laughs> I don't understand. Angel Royale. <laughs> I'm a comfy. That's when I first met her. Dare? <laughs> I can't. This is so wild. <laughs> What is going on? Yes, helium is a noble gas. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> She's just ubu. I am very uncomfortable with the energy that we've created in the studio today. Sam, I have to work tomorrow. This is traumatizing me. <laughs> Shared trauma. We're trauma bonding. This is called trauma bonding, Sam Salutation. Like, get, get with the program. <laughs> get with the program. The silence is so deadly, it can kill you. I don't think this is English. This is wild. What the hell? Splat? <laughs> I, uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I guess, I think he threw an egg at her. I'm, that was a little bit... 
Girl, I can't even understand the subtitles. Like, it's that bad. <laughs> it is wild. <laughs> so, un it is very unhinged. I think I need to breathe for a second. Yeah, it was like an egg. I'm still not sure what the plot is beyond, beyond pure primal fear. I think... It probably a lot if the background music wasn't... Yeah, the background music is loud to the compared to the voices. Compared to the voices, it's a little loud. Short King. <laughs> oh my god, it's so loud. <laughs> they got that shiny floors, though. I mean, you know what I, I will give them is, like, the school has lots of sims. Like, you know how sometimes the, the machinimas, like, they have, like, a school, but it's somehow only, like, the three main characters and nobody else is in the school? Like these, there's like a bunch of actual like Sims at the school. So I do, I, I give them points for that. <laughs> what the hell are we watching? I don't know. I don't know about it. This, were the voice actors telling, I think they were trying their best, but I don't know if it worked out. <laughs> I think they're chanting fight. <laughs> what is it? Yeah, you're right. They sound like they're trying to be somebody from South Park. I, that's what I thought at first. <laughs> that's what I was thinking at first. This is so wild. I, I, that was an, ex that was some, that was an experience. <laughs> that was an experience. There are things in this world <laughs> That's that we will never redeem. fully understand. Understand. We want answers. answers. We have worked years to build our credibility. <laughs> we want our answers. Reputation. Why? Why? Okay. Um, is that just it? Is there just like 20 years? There's like 20 more. Look, at this is all just credit. The last like minute is just credit. I'm, I'm. Oh my gosh, this is so funny. I will love to watch these EP every day seriously. I'm laughing so hard. For some reason, this kind of reminds me of code whatever. I don't know what that is. It's just a bunch of them replying. Ah, I wasn't in this episode. Okay, the voices are turning me off. Not to, not that clear for me. No offense, though. I love your work. <laughs> you know what? I, I appreciate this person's realist realism. <laughs> I know. Part two, when? Ooh. I kind of want to watch another one that's less disturbing you know what i mean this one was fu i i loved how ridiculous that one is but i don't know how long let's watch like there was a earlier one there was some up top that i hadn't seen we could also just do a palate cleanser of like mr canut singing 
<laughs> no offense, I love you. This sucks, but it's giving me the vibe of a tween trying to very poorly copy. Yeah, that's what I think. I think you're right, Robin. I think that was the energy. The the energy. Did I not watch this one? I wa we watched this one the other day, didn't we? The soda one, the strawberry soda. We watched Carrie also. I forgot to mark them. Not. Watch this one. Not. Um this one's only three minutes. It's called All of Spectre Strikes Again. Let's let's do it. Let's see. Maybe this one's less Not. disturbing. Maybe we'll get lucky with this one. <laughs> oh, this one's only two years old. Okay. Maybe this this will be good. This is Happy Halloween. Okay. Got a little got a little more up to date one here. Not, not the not, <laughs> not the not. Crazy Mark. <laughs> okay. Good so far. <laughs> not. Not. <laughs> This what Olive sees. I think she. I think she's quite proud of herself. A two by four nut. Good job. I like the. I like the approach of like, not. I like the approach of not um, trying to put subtitles and just kind of having the sim like their actions and stuff sort of tell the story. I think it's kind of fun. Ordered pizza. Yeah. Classic no eyebrows olive, yeah. Very classic, like Maxis everything. And it's like just the sounds of the game, which is great. Yeah, I know. A victim? Oh, you hear the the play. <laughs> the the play button. I hit play. Oh, there's just a gun on our table. <laughs> Wait, there's just a gun. Did you see you do you see it behind my head? Wait. <laughs> on our table, like right right like <laughs> Merka. There's just a gun there. Why is she still just standing there? Did she not pay her yet? <laughs> I'll expect her to shoot. <laughs> okay. She says hello to my little friend. Puts down the gun. Grim Reaper's like another one. She's got thumbs up. Olive with her thumbs up. <laughs> oh, this is so camp. This is funny. <laughs> See, I feel like Olive... It, this is hilarious. I love it. But I feel like Olive wouldn't use a gun. Like, I feel like she's she's different. She ain't, like, the gun type. She's eating her pizza in the in the graveyard. Her pizza sitting in front of the grave. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's funny. It's just her eating her pizza. <laughs> That's great. That was very good. That was very good. I'm going to like and subscribe. <laughs> I'm going to like and subscribe. Also, I need to fix my little face cam. It was down there. <laughs> oh, boy. I'm going to go over to the screen. That was fun. That was a good one. <laughs> that was a good. That was a good palate cleanser from the pet other one. <laughs> she would poison them for something like that. I think. Yeah. I think she. Yeah. I think she would poison them. She would. She would like. 
I think what would happen is the gates would lock behind the person. Like it would have been funny if the person turned to leave and then all of a sudden there was like a like a locking noise, like a metal locking noise that you could hear like the lo the, the gates engaging and then the person just stands there like, uh oh. And then she like comes up behind them <laughs> and like kidnaps them and puts them in her little starver room where she just like starves them to death. Or she puts them in her in her down in the down in the basement where she has a bunch of cow plants or something. I think that would be <laughs> that would be fun. <laughs> like that that would be that would be the Olive Specter vibe. I think she would have a revolver, but wouldn't it be her first option? Yes. <laughs> Only after she's, you know, done her worst and this hasn't worked <laughs> that she'd do the revolver. She would bury him alive. Also, probably that. Also, probably that. I think that's true. Anyway, I'm going to go. <laughs> Just casually discussing all of Spectre's murder tactics. <laughs> there's been a very, there's been a lot of murder themes this stream. We were, we were originally talking about how to murder tiffany burb and now we're talking about <laughs> olive <laughs> cow plant gives little shop of horrors true <laughs> very true yeah <laughs> something a little amped up i gotta go <laughs> i gotta go <laughs> uh get in the box oh god <laughs> that's when she'd use the gun that's you know what that's how she's gonna use her gun is she's gonna use the gun to get him in the box that's what she would do to threaten him YouTube hates gun, but not murder. Honestly, YouTube probably hates murder. Twitch probably hates murder. They're probably suppressing the algorithm as we speak. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go. Let me pull up my page so I can play music while we're going here. Uh, yeah, I'll be back Saturday and Sunday. We're trying out. I'm trying out Saturday and Sunday this week. So Saturday, we're going to be playing Calicundia. And then Sunday, we're going to be doing more of the PSP. I don't know how much farther until I like get through the game or not. I think I have a little ways to go still, but I don't know exactly. But yeah, uh, we'll play this music. Okay, goodbye. I'll see you later. There we go.